Welcome to The Bracket, episode 99. Today we are debating both the best and the worst Halloween candy at the same time. We're going to do an eight seed bracket on one side and an eight seed bracket on the other for both best and worst. Uh, no trade today, but we do have Clemmer and the returning champion, Marty Mush. Yes. Two wins in a row. Yep. I'm not um, sure how many other people have done that. I don't think that. anyone's done that. No, no one has. <laughs> good for me. <laughs> Very good for you. And now we got to see if you can do f- go for a three-peat. All right. Are you excited? Uh, no, I don't feel good about my choices. I'm not a... Are you guys Halloween fans? Oh, yeah. I mean, as much as an adult can be. Yeah. I guess that's true. It'd be kind of weird. I mean, Nick, why was that? No, you did a fucking Kool-Aid man right there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> um, It's fun, man. It's candy, and it's scantily clad women and men. Yeah, that's that part true. of it's true. I am upset. I love uh, uh, observing costumes. Mm-hmm. Like, mm. bad, like bad ones or observing like, I just like seeing people in costume whether it's in picture form or live <laughs> it is kind of the rare thing that's most fun as a kid and as an adult and really not in between like in high school Halloween you don't really dress up like maybe you could put some shaving cream on and drink but like I feel like it's like obviously as a kid it's, hey, it's fucking <laughs> put some shaving cream on yeah like shaving yeah, cream yeah you guys bites. didn't fight with shaving cream Oh, Long Island is fucked. <laughs> I feel like that's the thing. I'm from I Long Island, that. think yeah. the things they yeah. do oh, are the entire. I never did. I thought that was <laughs> like <laughs> literally <laughs> nationwide. Five. Shaving cream fights on you Halloween. Used to put like a hot you put, you pin into yeah. the thing into the what? top. What? You used to put like a hot pin into the top the top of it so it would squirt out. Oh yeah, faster. yeah, squirt oh. out faster. Are we you guys didn't do have silly no. string. We had, we had a little bit of that in New Hampshire. Silly string, yeah. Not not regularly. Would you put bars of soap in your fucking socks and beat the? We, I've never heard oh, of a shave. Uh, maybe a shaving cream fight. Everyone did that. Full Metal Jacket, they do that. It's like a punishment. I thought we everyone. Did, did we did that. silly string. I don't think we ever did shaving cream. Although I guess it makes th- shaving cream find. was like when you like were in middle school where you thought you were cool. Yeah. yeah. We did more silly string. Yes, I think more silly string thing. We're going to do first the uh, we'll say the bad side. We're doing the bad, the worst candy side. And starting off the worst candy side. This is going to piss me off. I'm jumping ahead. This, this is going to piss me off, me off so much. So much. Okay. I love my taste in candy. Yeah. Apparently, is dog shit. So, how do you feel yeah. about the number two seed circus peanuts? Oh. Fuck off. Fuck you. That's not a Halloween candy. You know you're. That's no. something that you could get on Halloween. Oh, it's a bad Halloween. Got, get that. The time I ever got it on, was on Halloween. Was, I never got circus peanuts on Halloween. I love circus peanuts. I love. Oh, they're it's, nasty. Well, it's a candy that isn't sweet. It's banana or savory. It's orange and it's peanut. Yeah, it's, it's banana flavored. It's so. Why is it banana sweet? Flavored? Does it taste sweet? It tastes like banana. Why? And the, the te- Wait, circus I don't know what circus it tastes like a banana are. peel. Yeah, you do. No. It's like a puffy peanut. The texture is oh. fucking disgusting. So it's so gross. Is nasty. Just oh, feels they're good. really good, and the Easter ones, especially the eggs, are my favorite. Uh, oh, that's just sits on your teeth. Purple, green. Oh, those are nasty. Uh, and that's going up against the number seven seed, Jolly Ranchers. Uh, what? Jolly, Jolly Ranchers are oh, good. Enjoy Jolly Ranchers. Jolly Ranchers are a bad Halloween. <laughs> Jolly Ranchers are <laughs> not a good Halloween candy, but circus peanuts? This we're talking really... about Halloween. Like, we're not debating how good the candy is. It's <laughs> like, if you go to Halloween, this is how I took this. Is if you go to Halloween, you reach your hand in the basket, yeah. and, and this is what you get. Your yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, that I think that's the remains way the same. It. Yeah. No, there are some differences because there are. I like getting candies I would never buy full sized. Okay. A full Agreed. sized like, Jolly Rancher? That's what do you debate. Mean? Well, no, I'm saying like bars. Okay. Eventually. Okay. So, Circus Peanuts versus Jolly Ranchers. We'll start with the returning champ, Marty Mush. Circus Peanuts, a thousand hey, percent. Can you pull up a picture of Circus Peanuts? Circus Peanuts, the, the way it's like eating a sponge. It, it, it's awful. Jolly Ranchers, like, it's unfortunate because you like your tongue's changing color no matter what. It's always rattling around in your teeth, and it's I hate when people rattle on things in their mm. teeth. But uh, I, I think I think Circus Peanuts are so fucking. I, I actually think it's insane. I never heard someone say they like it, Nick. Yeah, yeah. You're one of the first people I've heard ever say they like it. Uh, I would say it's in my top three candies. <laughs> oh, fucking crazy. Uh, Francis. Yeah, they look familiar. I'm so surprised that Circus Peanuts made the list here. I'm going to be honest. Candy. Yeah, it's just such a it's such a fringe it? candy. I, 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 wouldn't, I wouldn't even think of it. I'd forgot. I hadn't thought about it in t- for many years until you mentioned it just now. But with that said, um, Jolly Ranchers, right? To me, a bowl of Jolly Ranchers signifies that something horrible has just happened. (laughs) Like I'm leaving a very bad flu shot. 
experience or a root canal. Some I guess they wouldn't have it at a dentist no. office, but you know, <laughs> it's it's usually left out to distract you or to to sort of soothe the pain of whatever it's a just room happened. Can. Yeah. yeah. And usually a dar- uh, some kind of a bad situation. So, believe it or not, I'm actually going to say... Oh, I'm gonna still going to go with Circus Peanuts. Circus Peanuts. Clemmer. I'm conflicted here. So How do you get Circus Peanuts for Halloween? They're not individually wrapped. That's my... I'm kind of with Nick here. Circus, I don't remember, but circus Peanuts are horrible. Are they are, they are the w- maybe the worst candy. But I've never once even anticipated or thought or assumed I, I would either. get Circus Peanuts for... Trick or treat. I would I would reach into my pillowcase and always be like, oh, these fucking things. You would get circus peanuts? Yeah. All right, that's enough for me. Just loose? Uh, Jolly Ranchers oh, are yeah, fine. They're just, I don't know wh- why, but they you were- hate Marty. <laughs> yeah, I, M- Marty's dumb. He's got- he's, I don't You don't hate think him. Marty could be lying <laughs> to you right now? He's too stupid. <laughs> I'm not lying. He doesn't know how to like. He's too dumb. He can't do anything. I agree about that. Um, <laughs> no, I, I'm going to go with circus peanuts because they are such a horrible candy. And fuck them. I hate them so much. Mm-hmm. You're used <laughs> to the getting them like thrown at you at P.T. Barnum's, right? No, no, I'm not, I'm not a circus person. <laughs> I, uh, no. You know, That's shocking. You chose the politically uh, correct uh, term. So he, yeah. means he, he hasn't been featured in yeah. a circus. Yeah. Not that yeah. he doesn't yeah. like circus. Oh, you yeah. would love circus. <laughs> no. Uh, I've been to circuses. I went to a circus when I was three years old uh, at Madison Square Garden. <laughs> I was insinuating he was a carny, not a goer. He was the person. He's an, he's you an were act. literally. A yeah. You were yeah. born for like a carnival game. Uh, yeah. Post. Ca- oh yeah. yeah. And you right wouldn't, right even, right need, dude, you you wouldn't even need a talent. Just like your body itself would be like the act. Dude, he d- <laughs> does collapses. I would throw. I would throw money in the tip jar if he just did the the compact club. Compact. Get all compact around. What game would you be the the host of? Step right Step up. Step right up. Top hat on. Take your sh- I would like that dart when you throw the dart at the yeah. balloon. You got what it takes to hit a balloon, young man? <laughs> um, it's insane that somebody at the circus was just guessing people's. I was about to just say <laughs> yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. And it's still a thing at like state Dude, fairs. Curb, yeah. That's a curb episode. So it's crazy that people do that. Yeah. And they're kind of good at it, too. It makes no sense. Yeah. I would, uh, I, I only seen circus peanuts in like convenience stores, you know, like 89 cent bags. They have like a red tab and you, you pull them. That's where I've seen circus peanuts. Never in a trick or treat, but I hate them. So circus peanuts, circus peanuts. Tom. Yeah. I've never had a circus peanut. I don't think I, you, I definitely don't think they're giving out a lot an, enough on Halloween to be the two seed as That's fair. candy. So Jolly Ranchers, they're fi- like a Jolly Rancher on its own. Fine. I mean, there was the time I was in the car with my friend James, and he almost choked on a Jolly Rancher, and that really spooked me from Jolly Ranchers for a while. But like, if I if I got a Jolly Rancher in a in a Halloween bag, I'd be disappointed. I want fucking, I want candy. I don't want like a, a glorified mint. So mm. I'll go with Jolly Rancher. Being I the actually, worst. that's a good. That was a good point. I like chewing. On yeah, candy. So I want to yeah. chew. I don't, I don't want to. <laughs> The worst is when you swallow like a half of a Jolly Rancher and you haven't f- chewed it enough yet, and it kind of goes down your throat and it kind of like hurts down. It. Yeah, like, it's like, just ah. like my friend Jay. <laughs> it's it's also one of those candies that no matter if you are impatient, you don't. It won't really let you chomp. They it. last no. forever. Yeah. You can't yeah. chomp it. And and the thing about a gobstopper is that it it you know what you're getting yourself into. That's the point. It's in the name, everlasting. everlasting. Yeah. I'm feeling a lot of Jolly Rancher negativity from the room, yet none of you voted for it. Well, because circus, circus peanuts are Because circus so peanuts fucking are horrible, fucking man. packing peanuts. Not a real, yeah. not a Halloween candy. They're okay. You guys are, you guys haven't had one in a long time. If you look up Halloween candy, it, it comes up. So, Nick, which one are you going with? You're going with the Jolly Rancher? If you have a purple Jolly Rancher, your tongue is purple for the next week and a half, two weeks. That's embarrassing, especially like... We get in in the New York office. That was always one of the treats. Was a in the kitchen that were Jolly Ranchers. I only had watermelon because we're on camera. We're we're faces, baby. We can't have blue tongues. We can't have dark red tongues. No. Yeah, and that's closest, I guess, to the skin shade. And it really, really, yeah, it's closest to tongue color. Yeah. Um, we I, uh, somebody was biting in the background. Um, we. It's fine. Uh. It gets stuck in your teeth forever as well, like it, like oh, yeah, the little yeah. indent you have in your molar. You yeah. got it forever, it's and it's way more of a Halloween candy. And those are one of the candies that gets kind of unwrapped and kind of is a floater in your bag, mm. and so it'll get dust and maybe an eyelash on it. Yeah, also everything sticks to that. Hate Halloween. It's Halloween. What? what? Halloween. Halloween. H-A. You have Halloween. the worst, <laughs> thickest accent of everyone that works here. You have no business saying he can pronounce or mispronounce things. None. All right, freak. October uh, 31st uh, is Halloween. <laughs> Halloween, that's how I say it. Yeah, it's Halloween. Halloween. 
So that's all. Oh, Hall- what about them? Halloween. I, I haven't both noticed anything. Both are thing. right. They're both. Everyone's no, Nick fine. Nick says Halloween. Yeah, whatever. People say things differently. H A L. Yeah, but L-O. but Nick, it's H A L L, which is Hall. No, H A L L O W E N. Halloween. 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 Hello. First Hall- don't put us on Marty's side here, dude. Don't Hall- put us on there. Too. Oh, he's right. I didn't know. Halloween. Yeah, he's very correct. Halloween. 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 Hall- Halloween. Halloween. What are you gonna be for Halloween? The word hollow. Halloween. Halloween. <laughs> but hollow, like a thing being hollow, would be an O. Halloween. Well, it did come from Hall, Hall-, 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 Hall and yeah. Oats, and that's an O. Hall pass. Hall Halloween. No, no, but like you're 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 separating a word that's one word. You can't do that. I can do whatever I want. Uh, oh, no, you what can't. are you gonna be for Halloween? <laughs> what well, I think I'm probably gonna be. Uh, so Wait, it depends on what am I gonna be for Halloween? Let K be. Uh, Who's thing. saying that? Oh, play it. The computer, which is the smartest no, entity in the world. Any of that. Wait, play it again. H. It's, it's all we're hearing. All, all is we're hearing <laughs> we're, <laughs> we're, we're only hearing Halloween. 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 She said. Right, Halloween. So you're going with Jolly there Rancher, no Nick? Hall. There is no hall. Halloween. <laughs> Halloween. And frankly, Jolly Ranchers are a delicious suckable. <laughs> <laughs> when it comes to fruit, fruit-flavored fruit candies, I mean, the Jolly Rancher is probably has the best flavor. You're the most impatient dude in the world. But I can appreciate it. If, every, if anything, it's a good Halloween snack. <laughs> okay. In, there's a lot of not o- even a snack. You don't feel it's, there's a lot of overlap between different Halloween chocolates, and I think it's like when are you gonna like eat. you're you could sit down and eat. Oh, I'm gonna have a Kit Kat. Like I'm gonna sit down. I'm gonna eat a Kit Kat. You're not gonna be like, ooh, let me sit down and and have this jolly right. Like you throw it in to pass the time while you're yeah. It, that's and that's what it does. Great. It's a good boredom. But that's release. not that Jolly does Rancher not, is the equivalent of Angry Birds on the subway, which is you're sitting <laughs> down two passing hours out of it. Yeah. You can't also talk with a Jolly Rancher yeah. in your mouth. Yeah. That well, sound of it like, rattling on the TV. Yeah. The other option is Circus Peanuts. <laughs> yeah, that's true. We're going. At, yeah. The thing I don't also about Jolly Ranchers is that one one thing about suckables to KB's word uh, is that I like when they're you get through the suckable and then there's that interior core that's a different consistency. Um, I like that again, like Gobstopper doesn't have that. So I it's uh, Jolly Ranchers are consistent all the way through. It's just the same shit. It's like you boring. Change but your it's vote so Jolly even Ranchers. a cough <laughs> drop, even a cough drop, which is not a candy, has that molten. Sort of uh, medis- medicinal core. A little goo. Yeah, a little goo. I want a little goo. I want to find a surprise. Mm. Let me earn Jolly it. Jolly Rancher is measurably the the best suckable, and you can test it with the brain. Wrong. The brain, it would Wrong. Pop. I put warheads ahead of that shit. No, oh, too sour. Make sure tongue bleed. Blow pop. Blow yeah, pop. blow pop. Blow not pop's bad. a good Jolly answer. Rancher's not bad. Uh, I agree with you. Raspberry, now. Jolly Rancher, a grape even. Mm. Yeah, you're, you'll be stained for the next two weeks. My mouth oh, is watering. You'll be a fucking freak. Yeah. Uh, well, Circus Peanuts is going to move on as being the worst worst of the two for Halloween candy. Uh, number three versus the number six. Number three seed is Bit of Honey. Oh. Bit of Honey. What the fuck is that? Oh, it's that. in the uh, ah, Dwayne Reed. I saw it yesterday in downstairs. candy. It's, it's it like a little uh, honey square. Imagine you're, you're eating... A like, bit of honey? Yeah, imagine you're eating like oh, stale honey. earwax with a That's sweet bad. bit of honey. In it. That's basically what <laughs> it is. Is that a like common here. Halloween? Yes. Yeah, yeah. kind of. It's pretty common, unfortunately. Uh, and that's going up against. Oh, I've seen this. Yeah, just show, show if you could show the actual candy in the wrapper, it makes it maybe a little bit easier. But it's there. Oh yeah, yeah. I almost want to go downstairs and buy some for Tommy. They're making oh. me gross. They're gross. And that's going up against the number six. Seed. I really want candy right now. <laughs> Same. It's going up against the six seed gum. Uh, gum as a Halloween Whoa. candy. Gum. <laughs> Why? Gum's On fun. A couple different levels. Oh, I, I think for a Halloween candy, that's thanks. So KB, you're up first. Gum versus like, bit of honey. So I think misconception about bit of honey's taste. I think it tastes fine, but the texture is so horrendous. I really You're going to bite into it. You feel the need. You won't be able to stop yourself, and that's not going to be a pleasant experience. <laughs> it's going to hurt your jaw. Teeth. Yeah, I think the experience is equivalent to doing calisthenics. <laughs> for pleasure. Your mouth. <laughs> so one for bit of honey. Nick. Bit of honey falls into the trap that it looks like a grandma candy. It hasn't been up. The design hasn't been updated since 1914. <laughs> it, it's, it's like, uh, do you remember Mary Jane's the candy or Chicka Sticks? 
It's all that same yeah. design family. It might have been the same designer. Charleston um, Chew. Kind of like Charleston Chew. It all has that old dingy palette. I don't hate the, it. Everything was that color went back when those were invented. Kitchens, silverware, everything was that color. Um, clothing. Mm -hmm. um, skin. Um, <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's gum is so gum is great. See. Gum is cool. Gum is fun. Um, gum has yeah. utility. Were you the gum guy at school? I wasn't the gum guy. Kyle was. You were the gum guy? Wrigley. My uncle worked for Wrigley's and would just send like boxes and boxes of it. That's great. <laughs> Including like Starburst or Skittles Ooh. and all that candy shit. That's fantastic wow. club to have at that age. That's like, you know, the kid that would say, oh, my uncle works at Nintendo or whatever. Yeah. yeah. And he'd be yeah. lying. Like, you'd have the legit hookup with Uncle. That's a great one, too. I think I've talked before. I had the yeah. gum father in high school. This yes. Kid, Steven Lipsky. He would call himself the gum father. And you <laughs> Lipsky was? Gum. You went to Lipsky. The Lipsky was the gum how, guy. How is he doing now? Uh, he's the the king of gum. <laughs> yeah, but I just, I wonder, like, still the in the gum, gum game? Part, like, in school, like, what where they end up. Yeah. You know that guy's still, like, at his office job being, like, calling him the, yeah, <laughs> what's yeah. he, the gum god? What he gum called? father. Gum father. <laughs> It's a two for bit of honey. Tommy smokes. I just um I, I don't know if I've had a bit of honey, so I'll I feel like it'd be unfair for me to vote for that. I'm sure it stinks, but gum look, I like gum as much as the next guy, but I feel like for a Halloween candy, like I get it's similar to the Jolly Rancher for me, of like, yeah, it's fine. The gum is better than Jolly Ranchers, but like I don't go fucking trick or treating to get chewing gum, to get fucking bubble gum. I want candy. I don't want gum. Uh, so I'll go gum is worse. Mm -hmm. Clever. The only gum I ever got from trick or treating, I think, is double bubble. Well, I do like double bubble, which I was not kind of stunk. Double uh, bubble is like, like it's not bubble. bad. It's just fine. Seconds it's of flavor. Not a great, yeah, not a great gum. In my opinion, I I, I don't like it. it. Never, I never got like bubble yum or bubblelicious or a cool gum. It was always like double bubble. It's like a double. Yeah, bubble. you did never get the cool gums. <laughs> yeah, everyone no. Knows that. So, uh, but having was said that, was bazooka big in your day? Oh yeah, and yeah. I remember when bazooka was three cents. It was three cents for Bazooka Joe gum. <laughs> for real. A little square. Uh, it comes with a comic strip. It's great. Um, I got a camera from Bazooka. I mailed in all the comic strips, and I got a free camera. And then I had it for a week, and I dropped it, and it broke. Oof. Um, took me like a year to save those comics. Um, was, I know we you know, we make fun of you for being old sometimes, and sometimes we exaggerate it. That was legit the oldest. <laughs> I couldn't even make a any joke back. <laughs> it wouldn't match yeah. what he just said. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Like, you know, that was I actually when fucking Bazooka was three cents. Yeah. No, it's not insane. <laughs> that was he cool mailed his comic strips in from a piece of gum wrapper and got a fucking camera. <laughs> camera. That's insane. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we try not to keep harp on the old thing, but you make it that so was easy. Old. Yeah. It was 19 yeah, yeah, that's, that's so what people were doing. What that's what they, you wanted. That's what, what kids did. And you were the early the cameras camera. called pictographs. Yeah, no, it yeah, wasn't, yeah. It was like, but it was before you had to dispose. I had to go buy film for it. There's a big uh -huh. flashlight going off. Go, go, go behind a curtain and camera. tell everyone to hold still for yep. 45. No, minutes. no, we had to drop it off the photo mat to get it developed. Um, <laughs> that's all. I'm not. Lying. Don't you think it's crazy that there was prizes in cereal boxes? Oh, like, great yeah. in your cereal though. Like that was huge. Yeah, you had like put your whole hand in there. That was awesome. It used to be in the actual. Now they put it. Outside the bag. That in worked. The, it's why I in the cereal. It. Yeah. yeah, that worked all the time. I liked when they put video games in the cereal. They ever have that? They would have been in, like in a sleeve, but you like barely had video games when I was a kid. Well, I guess I should have been looking at you when I said that. Yeah. But yeah, ooh, those are the days. So um, go yeah, I'm gonna, gonna go bit of honey. Bit of honey, Francis. I'm gonna go with gum. Uh, because I just I don't even c c really call it candy. I, I guess maybe it's weird. If I think of bubblicious, to me that qualifies as candy. But I think of spearmint, you know, sure. trident, whatever the all those ones are, and that that to me is is an aid. It's a breath aid. So or like nicotine gum. I I just think there's like these are tools to a result. Um. So I'm gonna go with Some gum. The flavor oh. conveyor. Yeah. 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 Exactly. In which flavor is delivered? Yeah. I'll go with gum. One for or two for gum now, Marty. For the sake of the bracket, I think I'm going with gum because. Thank you for saving the, the bracket. No, yeah, it is because sometimes <laughs> we get away from the actual yeah. part of it. I lose the plot. Yeah, lose happens. the plot. And I think because I think you tried. Like I'm thinking about the person buying it. Sure. You know, and they're buying the the bit of honey. It's like I like this candy. Gum is like they were just at the counter, and I was like, oh, I'm gonna put some gum yeah. in here and give it to these yeah. fucking kids. Like, 
I, 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 there's, there's no, no thought into gum. I don't like that. Bit of honey, just like, I've seen that and refused to eat it. But I, I'll, it does suck. But I think gum is lazy. This is an SOBP, Sanctity of the Bracket pick. Yeah, <laughs> it is. It is. And sometimes we get away from it. Yeah. And so today I'm not letting it happen. I'll tie break today and I'll be doing – I'm kind of swayed towards gum because I, I do. I kind of agree. You want a non-buy? You want a non-buy? Well, uh, we have produced – we have Stephanie in here. Perfect. Steph? Would you like to get weigh Stephanie. in? Stephanie. Gum versus bit of honey, What's which is worse. worse. She doesn't have a mic. I unfortunately am in the same boat as Tommy. I've never. Oh, uh, never uh, mind. Yes, thank you, Stephanie. Boo. So I think that makes her an what auto gum vote. Yeah. yeah, Captain Phillips. That makes. <laughs> I've gotten bit of honey for Halloween though. I don't. We. Well, you're. Like, you throw it at people. It was, uh, you never wanted it. It was like the worst thing. <laughs> the, yeah, I think it's got to be gum. And what, I, I agree. There's. What race were the people you were throwing <laughs> bit of honey? I was at? in New Hampshire. You take a guess. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, I, I think gum kind of does violate the spirit if you're buying that for kids to take. Like, it's either you're no buying way, that lazy the, bag. The double bubble that was like had grape and it, the, the gum is candy. And yeah, like big league chew, pure no. candy. Razzles. I, First it's candy, then it's. I, I agree. Razzles. It's candy. It's just not one I or whatever. I it don't could think be candy. It's not what yeah, I want. Blow pops are candy. Yeah, but that is yes. candy outer layer. I make. I'm so fucking hungry from this conversation. Yeah. I, I literally am thinking about. Well, I'm gonna go to the airport tonight. I'm gonna buy the candy aisle. Let me tell you right now, we're not even in the good section. Yeah, this is all the bad candy. Yeah, this is the bad side. Yeah, we're on the worst side. We're maybe not even the best. Maybe side that's yet. making. I want to start better. audibly moaning when you're saying candies I yeah. want. Yeah. <laughs> oh. I assume we're gonna like finish out the worst and go to the best. Yes, side. exactly. We're gonna do all this side and then we'll go to that side. Uh, okay. So next up, we have the number four seed versus the five seed. The four seed is hot tamales. Uh, hot tamales hey, hey. going Hosting. up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was... That's oh going. Hispanic voice. Yeah, that <laughs> nothing wrong with that. That's how they sound. That's a Mexican food. Yeah, yeah. It was as good as your Wanton Sykes impression from the other couple episodes ago. Oh, oh shit. Tommy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's going. Uh, Hot Tamales is going up against number five seed Almond Joys. I don't get the hit for Almond Joy, but Almond I Joy's respect stink. why people hate so them. So gross. I respect why people hate them. That's totally fine. Uh, Mush Almond Joy versus Hot Tamales. I'm going. They're both bad. I think anything hot for candy is just stupid. But I'm going with Almond Joy. I think you are a fucking loser if you like those. It's, it's like coconut and chocolate. Coconut? No, it's not. It's almonds. Yeah, the and almonds. Almond the, Joy. It's the, the almonds. The it's least a nutted mound. Part. Are you thinking about a mounds? Oh bar? man, that's what I'm thinking of. Yeah, you're right. I kind of like mounds bars. I that's hate both. Both are awful. A mounds is way better than an almond joy. Mm. But almond joy is coconut, correct? Almond Joy is mounds mounds coconut. coconut. And Almond right. Joy is right. almonds. almonds. No, but there's coconut. No? Almond Joy I, I is agree coconut. With, I agree with Bush. <laughs> you just said that. There's I think there's coconut and Almond Joy yeah, as well. I don't think. I think yeah. you guys it's are the blue one, one, right? It's yeah. blue. Ray's almond Joy's have nuts. Mounds don't. <laughs> He's right. Yeah. Um, <laughs> no, almond. Cool. I can't believe this is an argument. Almond Joy's have almonds. I don't know why I think there's and coconut. And coconut. Yeah, I think there's coconut, right? Coconut. What's in the mounds? Just diced, there's coconut. It's diced so up. No, no, it's no. diced no. almonds. Have nuts, mounds don't. There. Okay, almond joys. <laughs> almond joys, diced almonds, and coconut covered in dark chocolate. Yeah, there's coconut. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's but there are almonds. Uh, but there's there coconut. Yeah. But no one's arguing. Nobody. The no, we Shut know. Shut up about the almonds. <laughs> Everyone <laughs> you knows the almonds. Fuck up. We all know it was almonds. Right. Arguing well, coconut. At and first, it seemed like people were, were unaware of that. Marty's uh, <laughs> opinion was valid. He said uh, coconut was the problem. Yeah, I think yeah. coconut's insane. I think everyone for... won the argument except for Tom. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. I'm going with Almond Joy. You're going with Almond Joy. Francis? Oh, boy. I mean, I could look, fundamentally, could I eat more than one Almond Joy? Yes. Could I eat more than one handful of hot tamales? I wouldn't want to. I wouldn't want to. I'd get it. That one handful would have served its purpose. I would understand it. I, I would not want it anymore. So I am keeping Almond Joy. All right. One more vote for Hot Tamales. Clemmer? Wait. We're voting out the bad ones. Yes. So, yes. No, no, no. Yes. You're voting for what you think is Which worse. Which one's worse? Wor hot Tamales are worse. Yes, okay. Hot Tamales yes. are worse. Sorry. That's what okay. you voted for. Yep, yep, yep. There is no joy in Almond Joy, my friends. That <laughs> is a, a horrible candy. Uh, we coding out the better ones. Yeah, we are voting. <laughs> no, no, we want the we want the winner of this to be the worst candy yeah. of this. Okay, side. we're voting for the worst candy, and the worst candy here is Almond Joy. Coconut has no business in candy, especially on Halloween. Almond Joy, Mounds, wherever you are, both I know is two different. Get the fuck out of here. I feel like there's no young kid that likes coconut. 
My dad's favorite candy. I don't is know. Like yeah. Probably a lot of I Polynesian boys. <laughs> yeah. The way you pronounce it. I got cool. nothing else to say. I got nothing for that. <laughs> uh, Tommy. So to me, like uh, the hot tamales, I don't like, but at least like it's its own thing. Like you get the thought of like, oh, maybe some kids like hot tamales. And Almond Joy is just objectively maybe the worst chocolate bar. Like there, if you're going to buy a chocolate bar, why not just buy one of the way better ones? Yep. So that is, is worse. Almond Joy. One for is almond. there almonds in it? <laughs> there are <laughs> almonds. Despite what everybody else in this bracket is telling you, there are almonds in an almond. Nick. Tommy, what's a mounds bar? It's <laughs> coconut and chocolate. Just coconut, that? Coconut, 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 uh, coconut, almond. All right, Forrest. Coconut. <laughs> I did coconut. not say you that. I did not say that that <laughs> week. Yes, Life is like a box of mounds. <laughs> 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 Almost like coconut. a silly accent. <laughs> Some water and an almond oil coconut. <laughs> Takes one mispronunciation on this show to turn the room against you. <laughs> uh, Nick. Um... Candies are supposed to be fun and for children, and Hot Tamales is a fun, fun name. Almond Joy. <laughs> Alm- it's called Almond jo- it, What is that? It's an oxymoron. Fuck that to death. <laughs> almond Joy. Okay. Joy is something that is a, 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 a euphoric rush, and then they added almond to the front of it. Do you think they're being a little bit cheeky with that? Like, are no. they? No. You don't think no. they're like making it a what little bit of a joke? What's going on? No. <laughs> what is going on? I feel extraterrestrial. <laughs> <laughs> Almonds are fine. They're a great <laughs> snack. They belong with desserts. I agree. Coconut is too. Coconut cream pie, pina coladas. Mm. Pina coladas. <laughs> That's not a candy. It's, I'm talking about sweets, desserts. Macaroons. <laughs> it's a fine taste, and I enjoy almond joys. Mm-hmm. I like the texture a lot too. Yep. And I, I hate hot tamales. <laughs> 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 well done, KB. Well defended. Either way, Almond Joy is going to move on. I'm uh, shocked by that. Hot tamales, I just feel so like you're not just a hot tamales are like st- bad Mike and Ike's. KB was just disgusting. stewing over that conversation, waiting for a certain. But he like, kind of yeah, disagreed I with everyone about everything. Is, coconut may be fine. All right. It's I like coconut. Coconut's disgusting. Coconut oh, no. oh, I like coconut. Disagree. I don't, I don't like coconut. coconut at all. Coco nut. I love coconut. Uh, Actually, my thing, I'm still like a four year old. When I say I don't like things, I haven't tried it. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've never really tried a coconut because I don't like the look of it. So I'm enjoying to move on. <laughs> now we can do our chain game before we get into the one verse eight. The chain. First, we have tiny gold Reese's. That was from Francis. I love the tiny. Those little ones? Reese's. Yeah. Those I like cool. this one Wait, a lot. There needs to be a qualifier here. I think that the full ones are spectacular, yeah, obviously, which makes to me the little one. If you're if you're being handed trick or treating candy, and you get a bunch of the f- orange full ones, and then someone gives you a fucking little Flat. gold one, to me, by contrast, those are horrific. That's not a fair well, thing. Though. Well defended. I kind of like the small ones. Thank Sometimes you. the big ones are like a little too much. The small ones crust are is the best part of a Reese's. That's all crust. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, it's true. Yeah, it's That's a good true. point. Uh, next is regular M and M's. I like them. They're I fine like them too. I hate them. <laughs> Not a fan of regular. Uh, I, again, it's another one where it's like, well, if they had never introduced peanut M and M's, I think peanut M and M's are worse. I fucking hate. Them. Oh, shut up! I, I like hate the, everybody sucking off peanut. Peanut M and M's are so much better. The pretzel. They're ones are not the pretzel ones. Rock. Any of the well, other caramel ones. Are really good. Mm-hmm. It's Almond crazy to me that there ever was an original M M&M and M that launched this franchise. Like I, I don't understand how it could have spawned from that. Do you know oh, how it launched? You know why it launched? No. It was. Uh, I feel like w- we're about to find out. World War II. Uh, it was a candy uh, soldiers could carry around. It wouldn't melt. M and M's. I feel like M and M's yeah. melt a lot. Yeah. No, M and M's melt in your mouth, not in your hand. Oh, because of the candy coating. Yeah, but why were the soldiers just carrying candy in there? <laughs> and loose. So they they would carry the candy around. About. They wouldn't melt on them. Mm. That and cigarettes. Hmm? Was that their biggest concern? Oh, that was Tootsie Rolls? No, but it was a, a nice dessert for them, a nice sweet for them. Oh, boy, these it's napalm dry. bombs are going off, but <laughs> b- at least the candy's dry in my hand. <laughs> Still got to eat, even though you're fighting a war. Um, s- I'm not sure if someone misunderstood this one, but pretzels. Yeah, I said that. I I, candy, right. no, I, I, I took this them. as, I mean, then fucking, you know, I like get it gum tough. isn't a candy, you know, like gum isn't a candy either. We moved that on. I, I took this as the worst thing that you can get when you're trick-or-treating. Yeah, okay. I would that. often get bags of pretzels. I would too. No, Way more than I got <laughs> gum. <laughs> what? They were, they were shaped like jack-o'-lanterns. Yeah. <laughs> yeah the way more than I got gum or, or anything. Gold. So I thought, I think this is a strong pick. Tommy. 
Strong. <laughs> yeah. I actually. And oh, Kendak tried to block me for it. You, you often no, got pretzels? Here, often. Like Snyder's? I got pretzels almost every house. Yeah. Like, n- not every Halloween. Every house? It was insane. No, not every house. No, I every Halloween, every. there were there were a lot of houses that were given out. Like Nick said, the, the Halloween pretzels. I, after you after grew up a, in Germany, after a full pillowcase, I, I would was probably hard. have twelve to fourteen bags of pretzels. Yeah, yeah, crazy. Nobody ever wanted them. Mm-hmm. After pretzels, we have chocolate coins. Oh, that's and, awful. You're eating aluminum the <laughs> entire time. That's also that's. I wouldn't you, call that a Halloween candy. That's a Hanukkah thing, right? No, they right? give it to you at Peter I, Luger's, too. Why are you looking at me, <laughs> Francis? They do. That's what they give you at Peter Luger's. What's I, that? You know what I'm talking are about? you looking at me if it's a Hanukkah? I don't think I was. I think you wanted me to. Uh, uh, you did. You did. <laughs> Back the tape, Shake. Razors? <laughs> yeah, I mean, oh, yeah, that was a cheeky <laughs> suggestion, razors. Very funny. Uh, poisoned oh. candy? That was another one for yeah. a laugh. <laughs> Just for a laugh hey, from the boys. Out yourself. <laughs> it's gone. <laughs> <Poison> <laughs> Ruining funny man Tommy. <laughs> Thank God we got the comedy office here. Uh, candy corn. I like candy corn. Candy corn sucks. It's under. I, it's it's now uh, been become uh, underrated. I'm but you guys that I'm surprised that wasn't yeah, you're right, a full, Tommy. It is full now suggestion. But did you yeah. Get, yeah. you got this for Halloween? He's like wax. Yeah. Clem, are you a Halloween like, candy? You look. Oh, right? It is <laughs> <I'll> definitive. <laughs> what are you saying? What are you saying to me? I gotta be honest. I always think of it as Thanksgiving. No, it's really like, Thanksgiving candy. Maybe like what? I think it's a Thanksgiving candy. It's I mean, also yeah. it's I also rarely a, yeah right. It's a candy, candy you're not getting candy when you're trick or treating. It's always candy corn is Halloween. Is Halloween color. I think it's a Thanksgiving candy. Candy corn is Halloween. It's definitely no, but it's kind of Thanksgiving, Thanksgiving colors. Thanksgiving Here's color. how you know because they have that brown. other kind that's the pumpkin. Yeah, they're the brown. Sometimes yellow. those will be together. It's, like, it's candy corn because it's like corn the Thanksgiving. Thing. Thank you, Nick. It's brown, yellow, and red, and that's like the Thanksgiving. But you get it for Thanksgiving. Regardless, you get it at trick or treat. You get bags of it. I did. I got bags of this. Cu- this. Uh, candy so you're corn. saying it was, it was left over from from orange Halloween and yellow Thanksgiving? Halloween and brown. Yeah, yellow. Yeah. That's Halloween. Package. That's not Halloween color. I think oh, it was brown. Even it was. You it was asked someone yellow, like white. orange, no. yellow, and white. It's I think if no you ask someone what are five symbols of Halloween, they would list candy. Corn. I agree. One of them. Yeah. Candy corn. hat, candy corn. I think yeah. it'd be part Can- of Thanksgiving. Candy corn, well. indisputably a Halloween candy. I think that it can be a Thanksgiving candy as well. No question. I don't even know if you could go that far. <laughs> Quit <laughs> proclaiming. <laughs> for, for th- There's no thanks. Is your ass can- feeling extraterrestrial again? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I say candy corn. <laughs> uh, <laughs> bottle <laughs> on Halloween. <laughs> bottle caps is in his next after that. I you love take those? bottle caps. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? It's like one of my favorite candy. It's like a top three candy like for me. It's like a tart. <laughs> oh, my God. Those are the ones that would fizz on your tongue, me. right? Uh, Not really. Fizz. But they're really. No, they eat the different flavors of, of soda. Boring. It's kind of like a you sweet tart, like wasn't a it? like a licorice, a root beer one, and a uh, cherry uh, one all on the same uh, bite. Uh, dog shit. I have a whole giant. My wife bought a whole box of like uh, of them for me. I'll bring some in the office tomorrow. I no, love that's right. bottle caps. Yeah, cool. No one asks for me to bring them in tomorrow. Root beer barrel. I would rather have a pallet of Necco wafers than a bag of bottle caps. Uh, 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 <laughs> root, root beer barrels uh, is the last one. That's all. I'm shook. <laughs> what do you guys get? The worst Jolly Rancher. I don't yeah, know what that is. Root I beer barrels. Never had that. It's like a little root beer flavored candy. No. Yeah, you have. Yeah, They're like little, little, little sucker. How do you know? I have. Oh, Marty, you have. They're everywhere. They're everywhere. I, I've never had. I, I don't think I haven't had, had one. Yeah. Marty's oh. never had a leafy green, and you're gonna think you're gonna assume he's had a root beer barrel. A what? I just assumed they were everywhere. What was the one before that? Leafy green. Can I add lettuce or spinach? Can I oh. add another reason why yes. the gold wrapped Reese's are bad? You never manage to unwrap them without chunks of it going with the wrapper. Mm. It Especially doesn't come off clean. Walking around. Okay. Yeah. Did those make the list? It, yeah. Yeah. Those those chain. Those chain. Chain. I love chain. those small rice. Wait, wait, what are all the chain ones again? So here's all the chain ones again. And then we'll uh, start out with UKB to pick one. Um, the tiny gold Reese's, uh, regular M&M's, pretzels, coins, uh, candy corn, bottle caps, or root beer barrel. Which one do you like? I'm going with... Um, What's the worst? Pretzels. I despise pretzels. Actually, I don't. I feel nothing toward pretzels, which is worse. <laughs> that is it worse. Nothing for me. Yeah, gotcha. It's got no feeling towards pretzels. Okay, so that's one vote for pretzels, Nick. After all those candies, sometimes salty is good. And at the bottom of that bag of pretzels, you would tip it back and have those granules of salt. That would feel it would be fine. Break the I'm going bottle caps here. Just the the combination of flavors in the bottle cap 
<clears throat> it, it didn't do it for me. One for bottle caps, Tommy. They're Tums. They're uh, Tums with They're whiskey. not Tums. I'm going pretzels. I thought this might even be like the one seed or worst thing. Maybe maybe it's a regional thing. I feel like in my town it was you I got the houses that gave out pretzels yeah. and were like, fuck. Like, I'm not like, just skip that house. Like, I'm not getting yeah. fucking pretzels on Halloween. <laughs> and they probably did it too to be like, oh, it's healthier than candy. Shut up. Mm. Pretzels. Fistful of carbs. Either way, basically. Yeah. Clemmer? I, I don't know how we're not. It's candy corn. I mean, this is the worst candy th- at Halloween. It's yeah. awful. It's like wax. It's candy corn. It's candy corn? Francis? Yeah, it is candy corn, and it, I think it's candy corn too because you cannot every time you ha- you can't resist having one. Uh, you just forget how bad it is, and every year you think, oh, because there's always a bowl of them. Yeah, there's a bowl sitting out, and so you go, oh, I'll have one, and then you have it, and you hate yourself yeah. for but not. Like, but like, hold on though, I don't know how often do you get them trick or treating? Because like Francis said, I picture them like in a bowl at someone's. Yeah, house. that that it is. I don't know if I ever like. What do they come in? I've seen a, a package. package. It was, oh, a package. company called Brock's. We put out like a, a package. I feel like that I, was pretty rare. Right. Right. Yeah, but I would. I, I, came I, I would, like five or six. It was Brock's. B-R-A-C-H. Yes. I mean, Tommy, not for nothing. I would get fucking candy corn way more than I would get pretzels. Me too. Mm. All right. All right. So I, the way you explain that, it's, that's like my aunt's cookies. Like they're always there, and they look so good. Yeah. And they're just so wow. bad yeah, every fake time. Fake news. Fake news. But yeah, I'm going pretzels. You going with pretzels? pretzels I think move on. pretzels. I it was always the most disappointed when I got that. Even as a general snack food, pretzels are nothing. You're a child. Yeah. You're a little. Pretzels there, are there's awesome. like, oh, there's nothing else. That's when you go to the snack room here, they and there's nothing, nothing stacked besides like two things. If you're a little pretzels. sick, you can have a pretzel because it's like that's the safest thing. No. Yeah. Okay, so we're our matchup is going to be the pretzel versus the number one seed. We'll just say wax anything. Um, wax what? bottles was the first thing that came to mind, but also wax lips when they give you that in, in lieu of candy. Uh, Dude, wax lips are gross. Yeah, and I don't know what the th- thought oh. process is there. Uh, but, Marty, you're up first. This is tough. This is a one versus eight. It's tough for me because I really got pissed off with the pretzels. Mm-hmm. Fuck it. I'm not, that means more to me, the pretzels. The pretzels. One for pretzels. Because uh, wax, you always like where you were curious what the fuck was going on with that wax. Yeah. <laughs> Is this is this that thing where you're talking about where they come in the bottles and it's yeah they were liquid. here for a while yeah like, yeah like this big and they have I a don't liquid know what we're talking about do you, you they were here in the office for a long time because no one wanted to eat them they uh, yeah you the, guys are the wax bottles yeah it's like little wax bottles and they come with like a little liquid inside huh yeah, they were like yeah. stacked over there in the in the snack area for a while sounds awful yeah, yeah. no no good but any I, think you got, wax, I don't even I pass well, on the no, wax yeah but you know slow down when you say it separate yeah. those words. Yeah. The only wax I like is when I'm firing it up with our old barstool Kush boys. Ah, uh, there we go. <laughs> we don't know who that is. No mod reveal. No yeah, mod nope, reveal. Nope, 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 nope. Uh, Torch a little ceramic bowl. Dab it to myself to the moon. Uh, oh. So you're going with the wax? wax. Dab it up. <laughs> yeah, I'll go with the wax. One for the wax. Clemmer. I enjoy pretzels very much. Sometimes when I'm on a train ride, I'll get pretzels in a mustard packet, and I dip the pretzels in the mustard packet. I don't hate that move. Great snack. One for, well, Clemmer's going with wax lips. <laughs> Tommy smokes. <laughs> um, I don't hate pretzels. They're fine. What uh, the fuck? You were just, you were hating pretzels. Yeah, well, no, 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 no. Yeah. To be clear, <laughs> to be clear, I hate pretzels as a Halloween treat. I don't hate pretzels, like... If you if right now you said you can either eat a bag of pretzels or a wax bottle candy, I would eat the pretzels. But Halloween, a uh, pretzel bag to me is it is, you know the the very example of a disappointing Halloween treat, and I experienced that a lot more than I did wax anything. So I'm going pretzels. Pretzels, Nick. I got zero enjoyment from any of the wax stuff. Uh, the wax lips, I can remember the taste, horrible, disgusting. And what do I, I don't I don't get them. You, you you chew on them for a little bit and then spit it out. It's a waste. The wax, I'm thinking of the wax lips. They're horrendous. They're horrible. Mm. They'll leave like little flakes, little red dandruff flakes on like your teeth that it will just uh fuck that no. All right, wax KB. So the wax bottles, they they at least have a, a sweet little nectar in them. Mm. I would put them above pretzels. I'm going to have to go with wax. Yeah, I have to go with the wax. 
Wax is going to move on. Uh, before we do this little playoff, let's talk about game time. Folks, we all know about game time. Big long-term advertiser here. Uh, we've used them, I think, all of us, all of us, every one of us has used game time here, correct? Yep. I'm asking yes. you specifically. Why? Why? Because last time you were like, you always generalize us and say we've all used these things. Did I say that? Yeah. <laughs> I must yeah. have been in a mood. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Look, you shouldn't have to worry when you're buying tickets for your next big event. Game time is the fast and easy way to buy tickets for all the sports, music, comedy, and theater events near you. You could probably use it to go get uh, a ticket for you for tonight if you wanted to. This is going to be too late to air, but... I wonder. Yeah, I could tis, get that on game Tis time. the season. Exactly. Um, <laughs> you can browse through the Game Time app and talk about upcoming events or look around for upcoming events in your area, whether that's concerts, playoff games, et cetera. Uh, we, I used it to get uh, tickets to the Monday Night Football Chargers Jets game, um, which uh, got pretty good seats for pretty cheap, too. There you go. Early on. Uh, you get last minute tickets, flash deals, zone deals. It's easy to find and buy tickets for every type of event in your area. Game Time is the only ticketing app that gives you the complete peace of mind with your purchase. See the view from your seat before you buy so that you know exactly what to expect when you arrive. All in prices show your total upfront so you know you're getting a great deal without the hidden fees. Buy tickets in seconds with just two taps. Take the guesswork out of buying tickets with Game Time. Download the Game Time app, create an account, and use code LCB for $20 off your first purchase. Terms do apply. Again, create an account and redeem code LCB for $20 off. Download Game Time today. Last minute tickets, lowest price guaranteed. All right, let's run through these and see who's coming out of the finals from the worst region. Uh, first up, Gum versus Circus Peanuts, KB. Circus Peanuts. Circus Peanuts, why so? That's easy one? Yeah, that's easy. The, the worst. The <laughs> Nick, you're on the opposite side of the spectrum before. I will never vote for Circus Peanuts. <laughs> I, used to have, I used to have a bag a week back when I was living in Columbus. It was like oh. my favorite treat. I would love to go home and just have, yeah, I would love Circus Peanuts. They're great. Try the Easter ones that come out. No. no. They're soft. <laughs> Tommy. Yeah, I'm going gum. I mean, I, I don't have that much experience with Circus Peanuts, but even if they're the worst fucking candy in the world... I would rather get that on. It's more in the spirit of Halloween. It's like where else? Would, when else am I gonna fucking eat circus peanuts besides if it's given to me in Halloween? Then gum. I could get gum at any bodega fucking checkout. So I'll go gum as a worse. You can get candy at most of these checkouts too. Not circus peanuts. Maybe uh, Clemmer. Almost every experience in life is worth having. Uh, even the bad ones, you're like, all right, I'm glad I experienced that. I'm better off for it. I've learned. Uh, I, I can make some big, <laughs> big cases. <laughs> There's a ton of cases, actually. Man, I, the the point, yeah. Yeah. I <laughs> genuinely <laughs> wish. Genocide. I, no, no, I have not had that. No, Third thank, degree no, burn. Thank, That's I, worth having. I am per, my personal experiences. Uh, most are worth having. I, having said that, I wish I had never experienced circus peanuts. I wish they had never been created or invented. They are the worst candy ever made. <laughs> it's two, it's two to two right now, Francis. Circus peanuts. Circus peanuts. No hesitation. What a Halloween candy. You don't get them for Halloween. Yeah, but I wouldn't. I, I would ever gotten gum never either. Got really. I guess yes, I did. I got some gum. Egg. I got some <laughs> gum. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's circus peanuts because it's it's false advertising. It's not a peanut. When you're learning your kid, you see this peanut, and you're like, oh, I like peanuts. And then you'd get a, False you just effort. said it's a fucking banana. Mm. Doesn't even taste like peanuts. Yep. Just looks like them. On the other side, uh, wax. <laughs> Burn. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> yeah, looks like them. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not wrong. Uh, not. <laughs> yeah, but that that's not like insulting. <laughs> they don't do they not look like them? Like, they look like them. That's they, all they, they do. They just look like them. They don't, they they don't do taste look like them. That's bullshit. They look yeah. like and we should be like more upset about it. I don't know that I know what a circus peanut is it, then. I thought they were those orange things. They are. Yeah. They're, orange. they're shaped like them. I guess don't look like and them. And they got the like little dots. They have the yeah, but they they look just like peanuts. It looks like a big a bigger peanut. Big Orange. It looks like a regular uh, size peanut. No, it's bigger peanut. than a regular uh, yeah, regular peanut's bigger. like this big. It's bigger than that. I've yeah. never put a peanut next to a circus right. peanut and thought, oh, I can't. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah, just about. We, we ran through the, we, we, the worst one didn't make the list. Oh, what did you? Tootsie roll. Oh, Tootsie roll? Uh, oh, I'd put that on the worst. best side. I put the king's. Oh, the Tootsie oh. roll? I love myself that, a Tootsie it roll. It advertises itself as a chocolate. And, and it is it? What do tastes what, like? What brown. does it even taste like? <laughs> I love Tootsie Roll. Did you and say it brown. tastes like brown? Because yeah. that's true. It's it doesn't chocolate. have a taste. That's its flavor. It I does like not have brown. a taste. I like the consistency. Anything but chocolate is its flavor. Yeah. yeah. 
Oh, Tommy loves Tootsie Roll. Uh, wax Anything versus Almond Joy. Marty. Oh, God. Almond Joy. I, I, really, I really fucking hate those things. It's just, why would you ever choose that? It's coconut and chocolate and almond. It's like not a bad combination of oh, things. Fucking horrible. Not at all. Just disgusting. It's the worst <laughs> combination. They make me feel insane, too. Like, I feel like I'm being gasoline and believing that coconut's a bad dessert flavor. It's a, uh, excellent. All you have to do is say, eh, not for me. <laughs> That's what I'm doing. That's what this bracket is. No, you're like, this is the world. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, I fucking hate it. Yep. Uh, Francis. This is so easy. Uh, it is the wax. I, I, I don't. I'm surprised Almond Joy is on this side of the bracket. Hmm. Yeah, I'm, I'm very shocked as well. Clemmer. Almond Joy, awful candy. I'm with Marty. Just absolutely true. Clemmer. It's so bad. Clemmer, have you ever been on the fence about anything? <laughs> <laughs> Your friendship. <laughs> oh. oh. Another bird. Another bird. Oh. Man's on fire. <laughs> I'm on my Mount Rushmore of coworkers, but he can whatever about me. Have That's you ever fine. been back in the when you were growing up in the '80s, wherever? Like, did you ever get one of those wedgies where they put you up huh. on by hang you by your underwear on a fence, Clemmer? Is that happening? No, you, what? No, you, I never uh, got wedgies. No, you're talking to me. No, yeah. who's weren't the you fourth? A bully? Who's, huh? the, who's the fourth? Clemmer, KB, Smokes, and then who would be the fourth <laughs> on the Mount Rushmore? <laughs> on the Mount Rushmore? Yeah, that fourth is always interchanging. Wow. Mm -hmm. wow. Gotcha. I can't believe you didn't just take Tommy off. There. I know. <laughs> that's that's it's too late now. Too late now. No take backsies. <laughs> Tommy's Nikki's number one. We're planning a a, a broad trip together. No cam. Yeah, that's true. Nice. That's right. Uh, Are you really? Uh, yeah. Uh, don't even ask about it because you're not invited. I can't go. <laughs> We're trying to get pregnant. Well, let me break my wife. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine that poor Mount and, Rushmore. And scarf. <laughs> <laughs> Cable knit sweater. <laughs> no wives, no scarves. Tommy hooks up with 21-year-old girl. <laughs> yeah, goddamn right I do. <laughs> I was going to take the under. Uh, Jesus, Clemmer. Uh, <laughs> Tommy. <laughs> uh, I'm a joy. I, I don't really feel like... I don't know. Maybe I just didn't get the wax thing that much. I'm a joy to me. It's just... Well, again, why an almond joy? Maybe I can, I can, I can rationalize like, oh, it's Halloween. I'm gonna get this wax thing. If you're buying a chocolate bar, get a better fucking chocolate bar than an almond. <laughs> I agree. With One the of these wax. things is wax. The no, other thing is it's, edible. It's curious. You're like, oh, I want to put this yeah, wax in my. You don't get to put wax in your mouth a lot, right. so you put it in your mouth. <laughs> it's like, what is this thing gonna do? Yeah, I'm gonna you know, eat a candle. There's no, there's, there's no, no excitement. Candy. Um, KB's about to explode. Nick. By the way, oh, no, why it's just. <laughs> No, <laughs> Nick. Um, wax bottles. There, there is a highlight to them. I like the mouth feel. I like feeling the ooze of of when I crack the surface. But the lips, man, the lips are what makes this a uh, F minus tier candy. It is not edible. It doesn't taste good, and it feels awful in your mouth. And it's probably problematic. Mm. Yeah, like so. It. So you're going with the wax, KB. Yeah, it's as simple as this, guys. Hey, eating, <laughs> chewing, and ingesting <laughs> wax isn't for me. Dream <laughs> 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 uh, mistake. Holy shit. Also, gimmick candy never is good. No. Anything yeah. that they try to make it like. It's always uh, the gimmick. Yeah, but I appreciate like fun dip. Like fun dip. Oh, I love oh, fun dip. Oh, no. I don't, I don't fuck fun dip. Is I don't fuck beautiful. fun dip. Not for me, not for fun me. dip's awesome. I love fun even dip. The, you can even eat the stick. Yeah, the stick is better, I would argue, than the candy. The stick is better than the dip. Yeah. Mm. Candy uh, candy cigarettes was pretty cool back in the day, I love though. candy cigarettes. Those were yeah. fun. <laughs> they tasted like ass. Yeah. Or like cool. those, uh, oh, like good. the the burger candy, like the Krabby Patty candy. I like candies. the Krabby Patty candy. That's <laughs> great. Yeah, those were pretty good. Yeah. Uh, the bubblegum cigarettes. Thought those were cool because that's probably the actual size of a Krabby Patty. Yeah, because yeah. they're it's a sponge and a crab, and yeah, that's a good point. Uh, pretty cool. Gooch, do you want to do you want to break the tie on this between uh, wax anything and almond joy? It's the almond joy. It's the almond. Yes. Joy. Let's go. Oh. Go. Wow. Let's Gooch. Go. So almond joy versus circus peanut. This is the championship for worst. This is to get into the championship for well, yeah, it's a championship for the worst side to get into our finals. Got it. Uh, KB. Oh, um, circus peanuts for sure. Circus peanuts without a doubt. Nick, I would love for the listeners who have children, <laughs> if you have any circus peanuts in your bag after taking your kid trip, there's no way that it's given out. 
There's not individually wrapped circus peanuts. There's not four packs of circus. This is fucking asinine. I think it and it, it is. It, we're trying to have a topical episode, and we fucking lost the plot. No. Yeah, <laughs> I, I'm very much with Nick. People are going to be like, "You're fucking embarrassed." This, this People are going to be like, "Oh, they littered. debated worst Halloween candy, and they said fucking circus peanuts." But, but I, Nick, oh, best Halloween candy. I'm, I'm nominating steak, Ken Jack. <laughs> <laughs> like a fucking porterhouse. I, I think this field is littered with those problems. I yeah, but, but I think them. Almond Joy is one that we can all agree you get. I never ate it as a kid. Not all but nobody's taking Umbridge. That. Nobody took Umbridge with, like, you know, candy corn, which... Uh, I took Umbridge. <laughs> there was Umbridge taken by candy yeah, corn. Yeah, I've been taking a lot of Umbridge. Of umbridge. I have Umbridge with candy corn. Yeah. Uh, so, Kate, uh, Nick, you're going to go with the Almond Joy? Yes. The Halloween candy. <laughs> Tommy? Yeah, I'm taking umbrage with the circus <laughs> peanuts. Uh, to me, uh, yeah, again, this is a sanctity of the bracket pick. I think if you hold 100 Americans on the street, worst thing you want to get on Halloween candy, I'm not sure a single person would come up with Sing fucking circus peanuts. Tommy, people. thank you for wanting. A lot of people would Thank you for putting peanuts. the success of this they show They are first. damn near yes. you thank you for loving the, the worst candy want. ever created. But a you Halloween lowest candy? Lowest approval rating of anything, <laughs> anything, any product. Let, let's br- should we bring a random person in here? Like off the street, or because oh. <laughs> we can't trust these people's <laughs> opinions. I think I think if you're listening to this, when you if you have kids, you go out doing whatever. Should tweet us Jack if you have. Right tweet us if yeah. you have circus peanuts at the end of the day. All right, and Jack, I'm going on and joy. You sound so fucking stupid. <laughs> I just say just there, there's, there's, you're never going to get a tweet. Nobody's well, ever gotten a fucking circus. We'll peanut see. For we'll help. see. We'll just see about that. Uh, Tommy's going with circus peanuts. No, I'm going. Or I'm joy. Sorry, sorry. Uh, Clemmer. Yeah, Nick and Tommy have swayed me here. Uh, I hate Thank both. You. I hate both candies. But what did I get more in Halloween? Ten X, almond joys, which are hard. Almond joys. Almond joys, three to one right now. Francis. Oh man, I I can't believe this. Um, obviously for me it's circus peanuts, and I'm just not even gonna fight what? the fight. Mm-hmm. Are you gonna what, what are we asking Jack specifically? All right, we're gonna say Nick. Oh, few, all right, uh, Jack. Here, pass him a mic. Give off the top of your head, what are a few of the worst things you get on Halloween? A few of the worst things like you get on Halloween. A few of the worst things you can get Candies. on Halloween. Or things just you can get as a kid? Yeah, sure. Trick or treat. My taste, my yeah, palate. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. As a kid, what was like, ugh. Al- Almond Joy. Yes! <laughs> yes! Attaboy! Yes! 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 Let's go! And the fucking Let's go! The fucking show! Oh, that was what are you guys operating on right now? <laughs> KB6. Yes, it's more. Yes, almond joys are more popular. <laughs> this is just no. No. no, no Wait, no. do you do you think circus peanuts are a Halloween candy? Circus peanuts. <laughs> like the things in the. the yeah, he doesn't even know what it's. No, not is. like at a circus when you get peanuts, like the like candy the circus peanuts. Ones. The orange big styrofoamy oh. ones. Oh, yeah. I mean, I, I you would get it sometimes. Oh no, those are not. No, no, they're not. You get it sometimes though. Almond Joy. Unbelievable. Um, but quickly, I like Almond Joy now. That's the right. ultimate when you get older. No, no, these people they're acting like it's not a big deal. They act like Almond Joy is still the most disgusting thing to ever okay. be made. I mean that. Well, I don't even. I honestly think well, uh, party's yeah. even gonna vote. Yeah. I mean that ended the whole fucking. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. How does? I mean, yeah. It's kind of tough to come back. Yeah, he now, likes Marty. Them now. It's Almond Joy. Yeah, Almond Joy. Yeah, Almond Joy is gonna go into the final. That is. Fu- like that's all fucking I'm, crazy I'm sh- stunned at kendrick you like we pulled in one random person that was instantly the first thing in their head yeah that's correct like how are you, you texted not... them what's that i really didn't tommy texted them. them no i swear to god tommy, I have, uh, said, uh, tommy said say say i'm enjoy my phone's charging <laughs> in the corner well, I mean, I make go sure. somebody else Come i'm willing to risk uh, i'm willing to double or nothing. okay double double right. or nothing. i don't the next person i'll go bring oh. someone in not double or nothing i just no double or nothing it was said already somebody said double or nothing tell him i swear to god Oh, hold on. Uh, All right, yeah, grabbed I'll, Austin. Uh, Austin's good. His life goal to fuck me over. <laughs> Quick. Uh, we, have, we have a question. Ask the Austin. question. When you were a kid and you went trick-or-treating, what are a few of the most disappointing things you could get on Halloween? Worst things. Worst. Any sort of fruit, vegetable, <laughs> like toothbrush. <laughs> like that's <laughs> Toothbrush? Yeah. <laughs> toothbrush okay. was, I got uh, What about, like, can what candies? Yeah, like a worst one, like you getting like, oh, shit. This Did you stuff. grow up in a commune or something? <laughs> <laughs> Did you say toothbrush? <laughs> Fruits, vegetables. Yeah, things. With, you know, heirloom tomato seconds. Yeah. 
No, I can't think of any garbage. All right. <laughs> All right. Well, well, let's just remember the Jackman. <laughs> yeah. no, no, trash no, no, no. trash candy? Come, like, you were like, oh, really? Austin was still having any candy at all. It's like, this oh, is well, great. Well, Thank God it's not more well, cabbage. With their toothbrush. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank God it wasn't more That was bizarre. <laughs> 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 Uh, you know when you got when you, you know when you got a celery stick instead of a delicious <laughs> navel orange like you really I, wanted. That was I, crazy. <laughs> for, <laughs> for, 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 for all. <laughs> he didn't have one I, candy. I, I, I seriously feel so bad for him. You could not name a candy. That Come was on, bad. Let's, let's go on to the Parker's oh, house. Boy. They've always got the best fruit. <laughs> you couldn't even name a bad uh, one. I got a pomegranate <laughs> from the Franklin. Fucking Colgate toothbrush. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, okay, before we get Guys, to... gotta go to this house. They give cantaloupe. <laughs> <laughs> before we get to the other side, the good side, uh, let's talk about BetterHelp. Uh, Lights, Camera, Barstool is sponsored by BetterHelp. Do you ever feel like your own brain is getting in the way? Austin might. Uh, like, you know, <laughs> you know what you should do, what's good for you, but you just can't do it. Therapy helps you figure out what's holding you back so that you can work for yourself uh, instead, or work on yourself, too, instead of against yourself. Uh, we've all, I think, at least just tried uh, better help probably at least once. I used it over COVID. It was awesome So because I didn't have to go and physically see my uh, therapist. Um, and obviously, at that point, no one wanted to see anything. Uh, they were great for that. Um, and if you're thinking about starting therapy, you got to give BetterHelp a try. It's entirely online. It's designed to be convenient, flexible, and suited to your schedule. Just fill out a brief questionnaire to get matched with a licensed therapist. And you can switch therapists at any time for no, any, for no additional charge whatsoever. Make your brain your friend with BetterHelp. Visit BetterHelp.com slash lights today and get 10% off your first month. That's BetterHelp, H-E-L-P dot com slash lights. We're big BetterHelp people here. Yeah, yeah you use it. I think we all have been sponsored on other stuff, too, that by BetterHelp. Shout out to BetterHelp. Um, okay, on the good side of the bracket, we've got a lot of options. I miss you guys. If I was there, we'd go on a candy run after yeah. that. Oh, oh, I was thinking great. we should go on a candy run. All this yeah. big, I want to I want to buy everyone. I want to force everyone to have an Almond Joy and, make, and see yeah. if they stand by their point. Yes, I completely agree. I, yeah. <laughs> Uh, the first up matchup we have is the number two seed versus the seven seed. The two seed is Snickers versus the number seven seed, Skittles. Wow. Very interested to see where this is going to be. Wow. Snickers have gotten yeah. too small. It, I think it depends on the type of Snickers you get. Individual letters. Yeah. Uh, so we'll start with you, Marty Mush. Oof, this is going to be brutal because I really love a Snickers. Mm -hmm. But a Skittle, I'm going to go Skittles. You know, Skittles are fun to me. I like a nice Skittle. What, what a, whoever came up with that name? It's a great candy name. I'm sorry to inter inter interrupt your inter being introspective. Um, they're banned in California now, aren't they? What? Right. They're working on it. Not yet. I think Why? they're a couple years away. It's an ingredient in Skittles. So they the gave color. Skittles like a couple yeah. years to change their ingredient or else oh. they will be banned. Oh, that's get out of here. It's a shame. It been, who has someone died from it? Mm. I don't know. I don't know. What, I don't know what the reason I'm is. I'm going Skittles. One for Skittles. It's Skittles versus Snickers bar, uh, bars, by the way. So it's two versus seven? Uh, two for seven, yeah. yeah. Skittles two, Snickers. No, yeah. other way uh, Snickers two, Skittles seven. Francis, look, Snickers got it right with their original formula. It's hard to say that you could combine I, 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 all those ingredients work so well together. It seems like it's a candy that hasn't changed and doesn't need to change. It's one of the few candies where I don't think any of its spin-off iterations have ever trumped it. Whereas, like, for me, the Tropical Skittles are amazing, or some of the other versions of, like, Sour Reese's even. Really yeah, like, all, all, a lot of other candies have, have great iterations, but to me, an original Snickers is always going to hit. Um, I love Skittles. I really do. Uh, but to me, it's Snickers is a mammoth in this field. Yep. Snickers. One-to-one uh, -one right now, Clemmer. I love both of these candies. What a difference it is in this bracket! My gosh! Uh, but if I'm if I'm in a movie, well, now we're debating best. And I know, but I get I get excited. It's it's okay to, to feel <laughs> things, Tommy. You can not be cold for a second. Um, Burn. But I, I get <laughs> when I'm in a movie theater. Frigid ass, Tommy. <laughs> yeah, you are. But if I'm in a movie theater, even today, I'm gonna I'm gonna I I enjoy sk like Skittles over Snickers, so I can't. But, I gotta go Skittles, but I would be happy to get both of my Halloween bags. Yeah, you gotta go think. I think Halloween though. Don't think. Don't think uh, movie theater. Skittles are are, are great. 
taste the rainbow. They're good. I yeah. think because you also like with skills, you don't know which one you're gonna get. If yeah, it's different sour. flavors. Is it gonna be the tropical? It's a the nice flavor of skittles, and it's pretty unique. I think. Yeah. I like yeah. fruit flavor, but a skittle flavor. I like the chewing experience of a skittle. Me too. Yep. Really good. And you feel like you have more of it than just a snicker. Yeah. Mm. It has flavor. the two textures you like too. Do you guys? Do you guys ever take just a handful of all the mixed flavors and and Throw them all in at once. Oh, yeah. They oh. work together. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. The, the panoply. Yeah. I think. They must remember, that. remember when uh, White Sox Dave thought M and M's were all different flavors? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, he yeah. tried to present it as a fact. Like, did you know they're actually all the same? Oh, oh, oh. I thought he yeah, had it. Oh. Oh. Still, Which still is dumb. worse? It, it still dumb. Worse. <laughs> worse. Yeah. Way worse. He thought the blue ones tasted. Different. No, he was like, "Did yeah. you know?" Yeah, he thought he was like breaking news. A lot of people don't know this, but yeah. Tommy. I was today years old. <laughs> yeah, Tommy. Uh, I like Snickers. I like Skittles. Uh, Thank God. I think though, there's a lot. There's Snickers might not be in my top five favorite chocolate candy bars. I like them. Skittles. There's truly nothing else like Skittles. Like I could get, you know, a Milky Way, Kit Kat, whatever, and like be like, oh yeah, that that I'm happy with that. I, I could get that chocolate experience if I got no Skittles at all on a Halloween. I'd be pr- I'd be pretty bummed about it. Skittles are are really good. They're very unique. I'm going Skittles. Yeah, but hold on, Tommy. I think the fact yep. that Milky Way is such an obvious bastardization of Snickers, and you could almost argue Three Musketeers is yeah. hot on the heels. That is a testament to I disagree. Snickers. Two different, but I'm just talking about what I'd rather eat. Three Musketeers, whole different, yeah, different no, thing. Not great. But like I mean, Milky Way just doesn't have. Peanut doesn't have nuts like a Snickers does. So I mean, it's yeah. just like, like and Milky Way t- or Three Musketeers just doesn't have caramel or nuts. It's just or all nougat. Yeah, yeah. Right, well, I don't. Musketeers is like a moose cake. Right? I hate. Those. I'd I I'd, those. I'd rather not have the nuts. Like I like the Milky Way because not. I'd rather just not have the nuts. No. So mm. homophobic. Oh, that's weird. Lemmer, you just look repulsed. I mean, it's just Milky Way. Milky Ways are elite. Uh, maybe we'll get uh, them. Maybe. Yeah, Milky Ways kind of uh, start. Milky Oh, yeah. I love oh, Milky Ways. I like Ways. the Milky Way too. Oh. I just, I'll get it out of the way now. I didn't include it. Uh, I did not include no Milky Way. No Milky Way. Good for you. Wow. The chain. Wow. No business has Boring. no business. Even being discussed. Wow. 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 Milky Ways. Wow. wow. <laughs> no three much tears Whoa. either. Nice. Growing up, yeah. maybe it's just because my nanny always fed me Milky Ways. I would always be. Wait, like, by, by that, do you mean like my the, the natural my stacked no, no, aunt like or? My grandmother. Okay. Uh, she, uh, she, yeah, I, and I was like, oh, Milky Ways, that's the candy. That's the thing. Okay. And then as I've gotten older, I realized, huh, Milky Ways are not quite the candy I thought they were. Mm-hmm. No, you're a bad like grandma. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> you're Nona? <laughs> yeah, my strega Nona. <laughs> Uh, oh, sorry, I slipped into Italian. It's my grandma, <laughs> Nick. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Whenever that happens, seriously, just let me know. <laughs> oh, I hate that I laugh every time. <laughs> every time. <laughs> <laughs> it's just That's funny. What happened, man? Um, Tommy sold me. Uh, there is nothing like Skittles, and I think like even like the little packs, they're perfect size. You yeah. toss them and you shoot mm. them back. Uh, they're great. Uh, I'm going Skittles. It is a good size. Skittles, KB. You guys ever let them like th- like the paint on them wash away? <laughs> yeah, yeah. 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 they start to stain like, your hands. Yeah, when you yeah. Them there too long. Yeah, KB. I don't like them. I think the original flavors are meh, and they, when chewed up, they become mealy, a little bit mealy. <laughs> <laughs> I like a Snickers. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> I don't like Skittles that much. Yeah, even like the tropical one. Evolved past you guys. I wouldn't have said mealy. I would have said caught up. Grainy. Grainy is closer to thinking. Yeah. Uh, mealy. (laughs) Almost sandy. Listen, I I actually love Skittles. They're just mealy. That's the worst part. (laughs) I don't think I like Skittles too, but I like uh, I like Snickers so much more. They're just no, and especially I they can't count up. But ice cream Snicker bars are unreal. They are amazing. Oh, I'd argue Uh, those are better than the actual. Oh yeah, that's yeah. But ice cream Twix, take it though. Ice cream Twix. Oh, I'm so fucking hungry right now. (laughs) (laughs) Funny though. (laughs) Holy shit. Uh, that would be its own different bracket for ice creams, which now I'm kind of thinking about too. I can't be Ooh. on that one. I have diarrhea. <laughs> Fair. Uh, okay, next matchup is the Kit Kat bar versus the Take Five bar. Uh, oh start with you, KB. Oh my God. Take oh, five. Yeah. Listen, I love Kit Kats, but my favorite combination, I've said this many times, is the chocolate and the pretzel. Mm-hmm. So Take Five nails it. It's my favorite. 
I wait a minute. Wait a minute. You earlier railed against pretzels. That's by itself. Yeah. By itself. W- when you add chocolate, it's something magical happens. Mm-hmm. And caramel? Do you like nothing flips? Is, nothing is better. Mm-hmm. Do you like flips, chocolate covered pretzels? Love them. Cho- add peanut butter, and that's even better. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> so. I'd go with the peanut butter take five here. Take five is this new kid on the block who's trying to do too much. Yeah. Yeah. Candy should be simple, down to its core. It's it's fun. It's easy. Take five. I don't need. It's it's almost like if a kid did a science experiment in the Wonka factory. That's what came out. This uh, is so wrong. Yeah, it's like, I, 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 no, I you're, no, you're spitting right like, now. This motherfucker's fuck. spitting. <laughs> that sounded so unnatural. Yeah, so you, <laughs> this motherfucker is spitting. Change. Are so simple, so crisp, so fun to eat. The satisfying snap, the perfect two pack. Oh my god, Kit Kat. Every time they have and other flavors. That was too. a very common full size that you would get. Mm. I'd say it's a four pack. No, well, That's like the, the Halloween size, size or the two mini. Halloween. Halloween. Oh, you Halloween. get the twos. Halloween. Halloween. Yeah. Halloween. Yeah. They have good other flavors too. I had a matcha oh, pack one. Ooh, Are you about to go cat? pan on us. I like the, the matcha ones are unreal. <laughs> white yeah, chocolate. Good. Good. White chocolates are really good. Mm-hmm. Uh, so Nick's going with the Kit Kats, Tommy. That is yeah, sad. I'll I'll echo everything Nick said. And here's my thing with Take Fives. Take Fives, hundred grand. I get them confused. What's the difference between the two? I get them confused a lot. So. What? Dude, they're not even close. Very different thing. They're literally. No, I know that, and I think I like one hundred grand bars a lot. But when I just see them and I hear them at first, I'm like, which one is which? So that's my thing with those. Very different, though. That's just a huge It's just problem. like, no, that's, there's the numbers. I bet a lot of people are like, take 500 grand, what's the difference? But a lot of people. Oh, are yeah. Now right. that you're saying this, I get take fives and fast breaks confused. Yeah. yeah. Very, well, they're both yeah. Reese's, those. They're both the best. Is take five Reese's? Yeah, they took it over. Oh, the, okay. the, it was, Yeah, I think uh, I get that. I think I throw that in there, too. So in the the, one you don't gra- confuse Kit Kat with shit about dick, so I'm going Kit Kat. The 100 grand bar is. You're not confusing uh, Reese's with anything. No, I'm not confusing it's Snickers with anything. Chocolate, yeah. caramel, yeah. and crisped rice. So there's no pretzel. Mm-hmm. It's crisp rice. What are we rice, talking about? The 100 grand bar. Mm-hmm. There's no pretzel involved. Is there caramel in that? It's yeah, like yeah, it's yeah, like yeah, a yeah, it's yeah. caramel. I like chocolate grand bars a lot. Yeah, those are good too. I agree with that. Um, but, but I, I do like take five more. Um, okay, so you're going with that, Clemmer. So I oh, sorry. Which one did you pick? Kit Kat. Kit Kat. Yeah. I Kit had Kat. never heard of a Take Five. Oh. So I went and looked. It came out in December of 2004. I would have been too you old. Kid on the block. I would have been too old for this. Too old? No, you wouldn't. Well, I wouldn't have gotten Halloween or anything. Yeah, I mean, you can't eat Kyle, candy. Right. I had retired from trick or treating ten yeah. years earlier. He's but you could eat, you could he, eat at it. that point, he was working at the gas station. Yeah, that's true. No, 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 no. I was uh, working at a, a newspaper selling advertising. Oh, holy God. shit, <laughs> dude. <laughs> so, it makes it so, so hard, man. In Florida. Oh and a newspaper God. in Florida. A weekly. Oh. A weekly. <laughs> the Zephyr Hills News. Tommy was seven. Jeez. I was ten. Eight, yeah. 24. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, and the newspaper. Actually, I was 25. Was still I, I came out in December. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I mean, this, uh, I don't know what this is. It doesn't look very good. I'm sure maybe it tastes what? good. I don't, I don't oh, no, it doesn't look good. I'm just saying. Thank you, Clemmer. It just Thank doesn't you, look Clemmer. good. It looks doesn't like a mess. It look good. It d- I'm just seeing the picture. I, I've never experienced this. What's a picture? We'll you, it's a chocolate like? pretzel. Looks like a slug with uh, crazy it's a crazy chicken matter. That's a bad picture. I, yeah, that probably is a bad I'm not, I'm, look, I don't know what it is. I have to get you one. I do know one thing Kit Kats are awesome. They uh, always are awesome. They are very unique. I never get tired of them. I've never experienced anything since a Kit Kat. That's like a Kit Kat. It's a Kit Kat. Okay, again, just to give you the note on this, chocolate, peanuts, caramel, peanut butter, and uh, oh, pretzels. Too mu- it sounds that. like too much. Hey, I, I don't know. Five things. I'm take five. Yeah, let's take throat. three of those out, you know? <laughs> take oh, take two. I want to smack that fucking Adam's yeah. apple out of you. Sweet and sa- salty. It's a great so combination. Much. I'm going to have to get it for you now. I don't know. What, I'm not saying it's bad. Those. I simply yeah. don't know. Let's get him one. It's okay yeah. we'll get, not we'll get to you know things, Mark. You should know that by now. We'll we should get one, too. We'll, we'll get, get you one. We're going to all we'll split it. Dumb fuck. Francis. Fucking oh my God. You <laughs> fucking Adam apple <laughs> fucking loser. <laughs> oh, my God. I love Clemmer on pain. Look, you know, to me... I, I I don't mind take fives. I like them. I like them, but it, it's another one of those things where it, it that is a bastardization, a, a a twist on on a Reese's for me, um, and a lot of these like, you know, I don't know. That's hard to say, but um, I'm not gonna have it beat Kit Kat, which is just such a fucking force. It Thank is. You. You're always happy with Kit Kat. Doesn't try to be something it's not. It is, uh, it's subtle. It's graceful. It's understated. Um, it's clean in hand. It breaks so well. What a wonderful jingle! 
How about that ad campaign? Everybody yeah. knows. <laughs> Give Isn't me a break. A good sharing candy. Break yeah. me off a piece of that Kit, Kit Kat, Kat bar. bar. It's just it's so good. iconic. It, 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 it's so good. So yeah, Kit Kat, uh, king of the zeitgeist. Go ahead. I was just looking at the the tagline for Take Five is the best bar you've never heard of, which fire. that makes it yeah. rough here. That's <laughs> fire. That's <laughs> great. Yeah. That's great. Uh, Mush. <laughs> it's just Take Five is my favorite candy. It's not even close. I love to. I would bet Take Five, but I do love a snap. Mm-hmm. Like I love a snap of anything, so I do get Kit Kat's my second favorite. Yeah. So this is tough. Same, I'm okay. in the same boat. Yeah, yeah it, Take Five by far my first, but Kit Kat. Yeah, send Kit Kat to the next round. Let's yeah, yeah, send Kit it to. Kat's I like like a hot dog that snaps. Yeah, yeah, love that's that. a good snack. Good, love, a good like, piecing. Snapper. Next matchup <laughs> is the four versus the five. Twix versus M and M's. M and M's, you almost had in the worst one. Eminem is going to be in among the best here. Are you going to do a specific one? Or are you yeah, do we can. I, I think it should encompass all the M and M's if we're doing the same thing with the other ones. But we can. Uh, we can make it more specific. It doesn't need to be the regular. It could be peanut. It could be cookie or whatever you guys want. I think it should include all though, because you get different packs. Yeah, we haven't been like Skittles with all. Yeah, exactly. Okay. So all M and M's versus all. We'll say like all Twix as well. Mush. This is tough. Sometimes with Twix, I don't like when the caramel gets kind of stuck on me. Mm. You know what I mean? When it's, it's going out and it just hits you. Too much caramel. It's too much, too much. I'm going to go M&M's because I love the pretzel M&M's like I can eat nonstop. So I love those ones. I'm going to M&M's. One for M&M's, Francis. Ooh, I got to say that shortbread cookie in the Twix. Whoever thought to put that in there, yeah. that's a pretty big swing from a candy maker. And it works on a lot of levels. I really like it. Um, I don't really like there's, there's something about. I don't like the brown bag of an M and M's. It just to me yeah, is fair. the most kind of dumb, dumpy. It's not Dull, catchy. It's not Normal M and M's are not. What, that a, good. what about the yellow peanut M and M? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Peanut M and M's changed the game, but it's like still to me, it's almost like the brown bag weighs it all down. Mm-hmm. It weighs it all down. Um, everything that came after, to me, when there's a candy that you've made after the fact as uh, the next iteration, which usurps, and not only usurps, but almost renders like irrelevant the original bag, it means uh, that we shouldn't honor it th- as much. Uh, tw- Twix, to me, w- is the winner here. Mm-hmm. Stefan, name the most disappointing Halloween candy you could get as a kid. Oh. Name a few if you have some. Disappointing. Yeah. Uh, the Werthers probably. Werthers is God's a good, yeah. good one. That's a good Candy one. Candy corn. In general, I'm not so Candy good. corn. Yeah, it's tough for Nick. No, no, that's fine. Um, Whoppers. Oh, Whoppers suck too. Oh, Whoppers. Oh, he's Whoppers good. is Those good. are all pretty good answers. Good answer. Yeah. Shit. That's probably. I'm a candy guy. But. Okay. Reason. Thanks, no, those man. are all good picks. We'll always have that Jack Mack moment. Yeah, that moment that was... was yeah. All right, boys, I ruined the fucking show. That was unbelievable, the, that <laughs> moment. Uh, Clemmer, Twix versus Eminem. I can only think back to when I was a kid, and you get the, uh, you pull out the yellow bat, like the, it was like a fun size, it was like this, like a square, the M M&M, and M peanut M and M's, like that was such a like delight to get those. Yeah, like, was I was like, head. yeah, like that's awesome, like what a great candy. And I still get excited about. it. I just had some uh, peanut M and M's at my house a couple days ago. I bought a big bag at the supermarket. They're, they they hold up. They're great. They're awesome. M and M's the best. They, and you almost feel like you're eating a almost a healthy snack. <laughs> it's such a little portion, like with them. Yeah. You almost think like you think, oh, I'm this is in gore. So, how bad can it be? (laughs) (laughs) You know? (laughs) I I personally never associate M&M's with healthy food, but, you know, peanut. Peanut, peanut, peanut. Just the peanut Either way. I mean, I'll I'll just eat peanuts. Peanuts have to be. The peanut M's It has the vegetable of candy. Yeah, Yeah. I guess. Yeah, but they're very good. I enjoyed them. So, M&M's easily. In in a landslide. I fucking love Twix bars. It is by far my favorite candy. I think it's the perfect combination. The chocolate, the caramel, the the cookie that Francis was talking about. I actually like the smaller ones, like the more bite-sized ones you would get on Halloween, as opposed to the longer ones. I think they're like better in like a two or three bite thing. Um, I fucking love Twix. I love Twix. Always have, always will. And I like M&M's a lot. But I prefer. I don't like peanut M and M's. I think peanut M and M's are the most fucking overrated thing in the world. Wow. I like caramel M and M's, like regular M and M's, and I like mini M and M's. I just, I peanut M and M's. I feel like it's crazy how much people like them. Uh, 
But Twix to me will not be topped in this bracket. It's my favorite candy, so I'm going with Twix. Twix, Nick, what do you got? Tommy. Yeah. I think we're candy twins. <laughs> <laughs> Twix is my favorite candy. Yes! Wow. <sighs> and I loved when uh, <laughs> it was a big swing by the candy man. The candy uh, man was yeah. like, let's, let's fuck around today. Yeah. Make something new. We don't need a bunch of ingredients. We just need something new. Mm. It's the perfect name. You, you could show that to a caveman. You'd be like, that's Twix. Mm. It looks like a Twix. It is a uh, Twix. Is, yes, number yeah, one. The gold yeah. wrapper is yeah. pretty. Now I, I will say I'm not a fan of their whole ad campaign left of twix, like right left twix. twix, right Twix. So stupid. shut the fuck up. You just make just make your slogan. We make the best fucking candy of all. Yeah. yeah. I don't care about shut up, candy like, boy. Right Twix. You keep making that candy. I'll keep shoving it down my throat. KB. I don't know what my vote is. You guys decide for me. I would twix. take a twix over the original M and M's. I would take Twix over the peanut. I would not take it over. The red bag crispy. Ooh, those are good. It's all M and M's. Blue bag. Yeah, but you're I, I going so it, uh, far down the M and M's. Yeah, line. the yeah. two main forms of M and M's. You're you're going. Yeah, to you win. can't. If you go that deep in M and M's, then you can't say it's all beating. All right, then I'll go Twix. All right, you all right. have to. KB, and what the was purple your... bag? Brownie. Brownie. Yeah. Brownie. Oh, what? I had the cookie uh, ones the other day. They were amazing. What about the peanut butter ones? Did you saw it. Yeah, those are really good. KB, too. what was your best Halloween costume you ever had? The Coke. <laughs> Oh, yeah. uh, no. A Chia Pet, probably. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. It didn't work. It was mostly duct tape. Of, like, <laughs> little lawn trimmings scattered about. Okay, let's do our chain for this uh, to go up against the one seed. Uh, first, we have a fast break bar, which we did talk about a little bit earlier. That's from KB. Big fast break guy. Big fan? It's my favorite, it's my favorite candy bar. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, I did. Inc I didn't realize this. I didn't include Milky Way. Woo! Milky Way's yeah. on the list for right. Tommy. Uh, Tommy also included Milk Duds. I just Milk like Duds milk. suck. I hate Milk Duds. Oh my Awful. god, dude! Suck. I like Milk Duds, and I knew I knew it would be this suck. reaction, but I don't cower down. To you know, Tommy, if you've been wondering how to fucking clog that leak leak in your roof, yeah, go milk get some duds. chewed up Milky Duds. I like Milk Duds. Call me crazy. Uh, you also picked <laughs> Tootsie Rolls. I like Tootsie Rolls too. I, I think they're so unique. Like, there I don't really get them <laughs> any time other than Halloween. Like, I'm not going to the store and buying fucking Tootsie Rolls, yeah. and I think there is something cool about it. Yeah, I, I reach my hand in a bowl. And there's something cool food. about Tootsie no. Rolls. <laughs> yeah, there yeah. are. Oh, yeah. They're like cigarettes or skateboards. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, dual Starburst, but you get both pink, like the double Starburst Whoa. thing. Ooh. And you get lucky, two pink. Lucky, lucky day. Oh, yeah, I know what you're talking about. Yeah. Yeah, and that's, that's a good one. That's a good one. A really good one. Uh, you also pick Crunch Bars, which are underrated. I didn't even think about them until you so bought them. I was thinking, yeah, I would never buy a full-size Crunch Bar. I don't think I've ever bought a Crunch Bar ever. for money. Yeah. But I Ooh. love eating them, and I yeah. love, like, the uh, the imprint of the word yeah, Crunch Yeah, that's on. nice. It's, and it's got, like, a nice, like, hatching kind of, oh. Crisp yeah. rice. Yeah. I think a Crunch and Bar a also, a little, yeah. a little, uh, this branding, it's cl it's probably the closest thing in my mind to uh, the, a Wonka Bar. Like what I would imagine a Wonka bar looked like. Yeah. yeah. You also yeah. Pick, in the last one, you also had uh, strawberry nerds. Yeah, I love a little pack of nerds. You shoot them back. Mm -hmm. Oh, the pack. That sound, too. Little box, yeah. yeah. On the cardboard. Oh, that's good sound. Yeah. Uh, we'll start with you, Mush. I'll give you the options again. Uh, fast Break Bar, Milky Way, Milk Dud, Tootsie Roll, Dual Starburst, both pink, uh, Crunch Bar, or strawberry nerds. Uh, can I, I have two things I want to say. Overrated, Hershey Bar. I don't we didn't think even I've included. ever. I don't think I've ever. You would think it's one of the best candies, but it's just the yeah. oldest. And uh, I don't think Hershey Bar is anybody's favorite candy. Nobody. No, I do like it though. Like if I it's like fine. it is. It's honestly the only pure chocolate bar, mm. right? Yeah. And most of the other ones have other sorts. Right, I have other shit. Like yeah. if I just want a chocolate bar, it's, I think it's just Hershey. They can kind of get to now. the. I like I like the full size where you could break them into little rectangles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. A lot. And my second one was this is very probably not a popular popular. Whatever I'm gonna say is uh, I can't think of nothing right now. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, Smarties. Smarties. I used to love Smarties. Smarties Not bad. Good. That is very ironic. You could. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I very probably almost liked uh, <laughs> everybody else. What's the Smarties. word? <laughs> you struggled so hard to get there. Smarties. <laughs> <laughs> 
That's actually a great oh, idea. Oh shit, that's good. A great sub brand, the... Smarty Mush. Yeah, yeah. I love it. Yeah. I could see you just uh... being like, "That sounds kind of close to my name." Yeah. Subconsciously, <laughs> why you like? Name that. wasn't Marty back then. Be like Candy. <laughs> go like Eminem. <laughs> Smarty. <laughs> My grandma's friend, we always used to go to her house for candy and she gave out Smarties. So I got those a ton, yeah. Um, Which one you want? Starburst. The dual Starburst, yeah. yeah. Okay, Francis? I'm going to go with the nerds on this one, actually. I love nerds. I love. A, you could take a whole box in one mouthful, mm -hmm. which I liked, and then you could just suck them all into one cohesive sort of piece. Mm -hmm. uh, I like I liked that the nerds. Nick, sorry, you're saying? It's funny It's funny and fun when you get a box of strawberry and there's like one purple in there and you think of his journey. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Yo, I think about that all the time when I yep. have it. That's great. Yeah. And it's usually, Artie, and I, it, Artie and I have a lot in common. It's, a, it's a yeah. usually a lot bigger than the other ones, too. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? A little bit. Yeah. I like like how'd you get like here, you little booger? Like forbidden romance. <laughs> yeah, it's for I'm coming with you. <laughs> Ugly duckling. Uh, Clemmer. Yeah, Starburst, and that was a pretty like I got this pretty regularly at Halloween. Those two, the two pack, you know, like yeah. I got. They this all knew. The time. They must have known that we wanted the double pink. Yeah. Yeah, double pink. Everyone double loves pink. those. But even if I got like I think double yellow is the worst. Even those are good. Mm -hmm. Double pink's the best. The worst is fine, you know. Yeah. Yeah. And then that's the sign of a good candy. Um, the craziest candy was the Pop Rocks. Oh, Pop Rocks. Yeah. Yeah. Those were you're just like it's just fucking popping in your mouth was insane. Oh, brother, make that crazy. Like, yeah. Crazy noise. They have Pop Rocks now that turn into gum. Whoa. Like, so for a minute it pops what? and then it's gum. I didn't know that. We are way in the future. Wow. Jesus. Andy's advanced. So which one are you going to go with the Starburst, uh, Clemmer? Yes, Tommy. Yeah, I'm going the double pink Starburst, too. A good pick from my candy twin. <laughs> um, I, I love the pink Starburst to get them both. It's, it's fucking uh, worse. You nice. would like uh, two in the pink. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah sure. <laughs> uh, so candy, pink. Can Starburst. Starburst. Can not like a packaged option. That's just luck of the draw. Right, but yeah. that adds to the Halloween yeah. experience. Yeah, it's a very bracket esque pick. Kind of. yeah. Look, I know very Fat Fast Break isn't a Halloween candy. So, what are the other picks? Uh, it is Fast Break, Milky Way, Milk Dud, Tootsie Roll, uh, Dual Starburst, Crunch Bar, and Strawberry Nerds. Yeah, I'll do the the Starburst. Send Star it through Starburst. I actually don't like why the Starburst has made a bag full of pinks. Where it's like I liked, I even I, I liked kind of getting the bad ones. ones. Yeah. yeah, you had no, to earn it. Go through it. Yeah, yeah don't earn just it. like get pink every time. I don't you can't have the sweet without the sour. Yeah. I think half the half pink. Get rid of the fucking yellows and sure. do do red, orange, orange. pink. pink. Yeah. So uh, the reds are good. Our Starburst are going to go up against the number. But it's like just be a pink. Yeah, because it's similar enough to the flavor that I just rather pink. Um, it's the Starburst is going up against the number one seed Reese's Cup. I mean, if you guys want, we can just make it all Reese's. It can be like Reese's. Or actually, is that Violet the Spirit? It doesn't matter. Well, it, takes, it hurts your fast break and your. Um, yeah. Right back. Yeah. Take five. Let's say it's Reese's Cup for now. Uh, uh, Reese's. Plummer, what's your vote before you go? Reese's Cup for Starburst. D what's your vote? Just say your vote. <laughs> Oh, you know what? I bet he has like a Reese's cup oh, on yep, his that's desk. That's why. Yeah, good call. It's gonna be yeah. such a bad bit. Yeah, yeah. 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 What's can, all? can we can we yeah, can we try right a thing where none of us wait, talk to Clemmer for the rest of the episode? None of us not, talk yeah. to Clemmer. Or we should have the whole audience watching just tweet at Clemmer what like how's your rash doing? You're just uh, <laughs> how's his rash doing on? All right, here it comes with it. Nobody talked to him. All right, who was already your vote? It's 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 no, it's KB's and it's Reese's versus. I'm going Reese's easy. Reese's easy. Significantly better, Nick. One of the most, uh, this was sticks with me. I called them Reese's, and then they were like, and I was calling them Reese's Pieces, like the pieces. Um, I it was something I realized I was saying wrong forever, and I tried to defend it and I couldn't. Yeah, um, it's very cool. embarrassing. Traction, it's Reese. Reese is. Yeah, Reese is. Uh, yeah, there's no real downside. I like the single packs. They're they're. The peanut butter they have in there is unlike any other peanut butter. I don't know what right. they did. It's a, it's a real, real special That's thing. so true. You can never find mm. that peanut butter. Yeah, but they do sell it, but it's not as good in the jar just yep. as yeah. itself. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm going uh, Reese's. Two for Reese's, Tommy. I'm ready to get scorched for this, but I think Reese's are a little bit overrated. I like them. I'm changing my vote. Don't get me wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I like Reese's. But I Reese's just think being overrated would still make them incredible. 
I think they're very good. I don't. I think we just anoint them as like the best candy, bar none. We can't even debate it. I don't think that's true. I like Twix more. I like Milky Way's more. Hell, I probably like Kit Kats and Snickers more too. Milky Way over Reese's. That's crazy. insane. I've just Thank always been that. Team Caramel over Peanut Butter. Um, I just like the flavor more. I don't dislike Reese's. I'll actually vote them through here. But just something to get on your radar for future voting rounds for me. <laughs> Three for Reese's. Saying you don't like Reese's right now is like saying I did not say I don't like them. Swift, Marty. Yeah, Marty, Marty, I did not I'm say I don't like them. You, you really don't. You're just you're pandering to the crowd. I'm not, if I pandered, I would have said, "Oh, Reese's! I love the fucking candy." <laughs> I would have brought a fucking bag of Reese's. <laughs> <into the recording. laughs> oh, you boy! Here you go, Marty Mush. Huh? How about this? I'm taking one. Uh, I'm taking one. Ab- absolutely. I'm, oh absolutely. Oh, my God. Oh, uh, you like it? Gooch. We have to take it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Gooch right yeah. in the head. How about that? Uh, Look at this. Even for you, you Wait, Clemmer, aren't you, aren't you lactose? Uh, I am. And you still eat Reese's? Well, there's no cheese. Just chocolate. <laughs> I can have chocolate. Do you have any mini chocolate? Is it not milk chocolate? Yeah, yeah. Chocolate? I don't, it doesn't give me the diarrhea, though. Wow. It's good though, right? I got I got those as a snack yesterday. I was gonna, you know, give people it for Halloween, but that's fun, you know. The only downside is too much garbage when you're done eating. Yeah, God damn, this is so good. You're so right though, Nick. The the crust is incredible. Mm-hmm. Crust is the best part. That's why I like the little guys. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's not rep- you can't replicate it. I've seen people try to. The make big ones own. are way too big. Mm-hmm. Yes. Oh Way God. too. I don't know if that's the. Are you not going to be able to finish it? No, they no, are it's too. Just like big. there's too much of that much. middle. You don't get enough crust. So that's like the Oreo. That's like mega stuffed. Yeah, too yeah, much. Yeah. That's way too much. I got so much chocolate in my mouth. No, listen. So, so I'm just. I like that. The Reese's. It's really good. I won't deny that it's really. Good. So you're going with Reese's? I'm assuming. Of course. Another one for Reese's going to win, but. Is that your number one candy, Clemmer? It's it's magic. I don't know. It's up there, though. Skittles are really good. You would love a take five, though. Mm. It's the same thing. Yeah. Uh, well, this, this I might. Is, this I is magic. Uh, it, it's magic. I, uh, it'll it'll be it'll be it'll last p- beyond humans on Earth. Um, it's Reese's for sure. It just made me so happy. It's so no. good. Like it just gave me. It gives you like ecstasy eating a Reese's. It was by far the thing I was the most excited to get as a kid mm-hmm. when right. I. Oh yeah. Went went trick or treating. For sure. Marty? Reese's. It's even crazy. Like, the Reese's Pieces still is so good, too. Yep. Oh, no. not a fan of those. The Reese's Pieces no. are good. The peanut butter yeah, Reese's Pieces are You guys don't like the peanut candy. I don't yeah, like no. still good. I don't like the covered. I don't chocolate. like those. That Those, I would say, borderline don't like. Yeah, I don't mm-hmm. like them. That's crazy. So, now we can run through the rest of this side of the bracket. Um, and we have first. Or actually, we should run through our last side probably first, right? Makes more sense. About before we get through and get straight into the playoffs. So we'll talk about Omaha Steaks first. Another great food. Uh, Omaha Steaks falls in the air, and that means we're looking forward to crisp mornings, falling leaves, and sweater weather. More importantly, it's the perfect time for fall grilling, tailgating, and cozy comfort food. Omaha Steaks are the world's best beef, uh, naturally aged for the ultimate in tenderness, juiciness, and flavor. They have all your fall cravings covered with 50% off site-wide during their semi-annual sale. That's 50% off all of your favorite tender, juicy, extra-aged steaks, like their butcher's cut filet mignons. Go to omahasteaks.com today and use code LIGHTS at checkout for an extra $30 off your order. With Omaha Steaks, the possibilities are endless, endless flavors, and endless value on incredible entrees, scrumptious sides, and decadent desserts, and more. Uh, and all of them are 50% off during the semi-annual sale, and every bite is backed by their 100% unconditional guarantee. Every steak and entree is flash-frozen, vacuum-sealed, and ready for whenever you want to grill. So go to omahasteaks.com and shop all of your delicious favorites for half the price. Don't forget to enter a promo code LIGHTS at checkout for an extra $30 off. Hurry, this sale is only for a limited time. Minimum purchase may apply. Shout out to Omaha Steaks. Uh, Love to get that in a Halloween bag. Yeah, if I get Omaha Steaks, you know, yeah, oh yeah. Um... <laughs> Adult Halloween would actually be kind of fun. Imagine just yeah. like a pillowcase leaking of like uh, meat juice. Juices. Yeah, no, it's flash frozen, so no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, okay, so Kit Kat versus Skittles. Uh, you're up first, Marty. Uh, I gotta go, Kit Kat. I'm a. I Kit Kat's my second favorite candy. Again, I just love the snap. Mm-hmm. Big Kit Kat guy. Francis. I could have a lot more Kit Kats than Skittles. This one's tough for me. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yep. That's what? not true. <laughs> yes, I can. More kit, more full Kit Kat bars than Skittles. Yeah, Skittles no. get too uh, sweet for me, and I like stop eating them half. But you, throat. a bag of Skittles. 20, no, no, no. Thirty. No, it's more than thirty Skittles. Okay, even Probably. more toward my point. <laughs> 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 That's less. That's any less smarty. I could eat so many Kit Kats. If I'm in a movie, like in a movie theater, I got finished a giant like movie theater bag. I know. Of Skittles. And so will I, but my teeth will feel. Yeah, they're you awful. Awful. Your stomach when you're like, yeah. awful. 25 Kit Kat. Well, I'm saying like because one counts as one. One sliver counts as one. One, one bar of the Kit Kat. Yeah, fair. Yeah. I could eat 25 of those easily. 
I think it probably could too. More hundred percent. Six four pack. I feel like ass after. Uh, Those I are like do we're it. eating wafers there. It's yeah. very light. Skittles though, you could just mindlessly eat a hundred. No, but then like you're saying, like, your teeth start hurting and, and it's like your stomach starts. I, d- I, I don't. I'm See, not disagreeing. No, no, no. What? Challenge him formally, Tommy. For yeah, every once I formally challenge you in a sitting to eat more Kit Kats than Skittles. Well, yeah, you but what, what are you eating? What, is it one to I'm, one? I'm not yeah. eating shit. Yes, no, what are, what's, what's the challenge? Yeah, what's what the, am I get, I'm not, him. So what? You want I'm not. I'm not. What okay, you have to do one? one I'm not. Kit-Kat? I'm Tommy not sucks at challenges. All right, fine. I'll I'll eat more Skittles than you eat Kit Kat. Right, Easily. Yeah. Oh. He to be clear, well, his thing. His thing. You're was, disagreeing with that? I think I could. Eat, I, I yeah. I can. His thing. He can eat more Kit Kats. Then he it's can be eat tough Skittles. It's going to be tough. tough. And he just gets one Skittle, the one kick. I thought it would be. I, I, I thought, I thought, I thought, I thought like, you were competing like against yourself. I think I'll, I'll be honest. Thing. I thought it'd be like two Skittles to one kick. Well, that's, that's fair. just that's not fair. what you said. No, no it's not. That's They're the same length. I think you still went That's what I thought, though. Just take the no, I'm not agreeing. <laughs> the deal was do, one Skittle versus wait, one kick. You could do a caloric. You could do a caloric comparison and just say however many Skittles. That's not what the debate was. We're bringing up. That's what I was thinking about. Do wait. What? Do wait. Do it and wait. I, what Marty said is he I was thinking more about number like of Kit Kats. He's giving you two to one. Just grab it. <laughs> I, it's you can grab like said. 20 Skittles. That's 10 Kit Kats. I okay. agree. Two, two, to one. two to one's fine. He's going to ruin, you're ruin, you're ruin them. But what, all right, so then what, what size Kit Kat? And we're saying like every. Kit, I'd say like, like, what do you call it? The Halloween size. Yeah. Halloween. So, okay, so just make every rule for Marty. And then that <laughs> can, <laughs> Hold on. I would argue to two? make it really Tommy, fair, I would say one stick. To two Skittles. Yeah, one hot, one hot of the Tommy, Halloween stick. You should stick. bury him. You could have 40 in 30 yeah, seconds. That's Tommy. fair. I'll do Guess this. I'm just saying. Stomach this, problems. This, that's not me. I'm just saying this changed huh? drastically <laughs> from what Marty said. <laughs> no, that's what I meant, though. <laughs> Every time, dude. Every time. That one was really word. good. He that hears was. a word that has to do with, like, gastro system. <laughs> yeah. And before I can even process it, he's, his brain has already told him to make the fart sound. Yeah, I just it's said absurd. stomach problems. And it <laughs> like came human out. instinct. Uh, so Marty said he personally <laughs> could eat more Kit Kats than Skittles, and somehow this is now I could eat double as many Skittles as Marty could eat. Yeah. So it is not what he said, but fine, we'll do it. You could do it, though. You're going to win. Yeah, no, it's a cute little thing. We'll do it. It'll be easy. Uh, do it to end this episode. Go grab them. Yeah, go grab them. Two <laughs> Skittles no, to one stick of a small, which means yeah, you're small. eating four Skittles to a pack, a little pack of Kit Kat. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's more than fair. Right. Francis, uh, Kit Kat versus Skittles. No, I'm not. Kit Kat versus Skittles. I'm going to go Skittles. Oh, you're my candy twin. Don't let me down. I'm going Skittles on this baby. one. Let me down, twinny. <laughs> Skittles, Clemmer. Skittles. Two for Skittles. What? Tommy? What are we debating? A Kit Kat for Skittles? Jesus Christ, Tommy. <laughs> <laughs> um... I mean, Kit Kat. I know this goes against out of the debate, <laughs> but I do. Uh, I think I like Kit Kats more than Skittles. That being said, I could obviously eat more Skittles. Kit Kat. We're two to two. Nick. It's Kit Kat here. Kit Kat is elite. Twinning once yeah, again. Kit Kat. Kit Kat for sure. Marty was. It's the sound. It's the taste. It's yeah. everything. It's got it all. Yeah. Fruit flavors. It yeah. doesn't have that. Yeah, that's true. It doesn't have that. I was so. This was so. I mean, I could have gone either way. It's fifty-fifty for me on this. Reese's versus Twix. This is a tough one. No. Like, dude, no, I don't. I don't mean like it's tough. Like, yeah, it's obviously Reese's, but like, uh, I just, I love both these candies a lot. Twix. Wow. Yeah, okay. You're well, gonna get, KB, you're gonna get KB. two Twix at least. KB. Kit Kat. Well, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Someone doesn't know. Damn. The match up. Is uh, Reese's uh, versus Twix. Reese's. Reese's. <laughs> the guy likes it. What do you like? Reese's. Nick. It's Twix here. It's Twix here. Twix, wow. Tommy? I'm with my Twixy 20 and going with Twix. And I know it's going to be <laughs> four two Reese's you because suck, that's what the mob said. The mob mentality decided Reese's. I want mentality. You guys are, you guys are part yeah. of the problem. You're going to get your Pfizer vaccines and eat your Reese's. <laughs> I, I sensed him going into Trump mode <laughs> as he went on. I'm like, where is it going to hit? <laughs> uh, Clemmer? This is Reese's peanut butter cups? Yeah. Versus... Twix versus Twix. I mean, this is what are we doing here? Reese's peanut butter cups. This is obvious. What are we doing? Like, <laughs> like this is dumb. This is fair, we're debating what's it's a better candy, and these are two really good candies. It's not I a debate. Fair debate. I feel bad and for Twix. Barium boys. I feel bad yeah. for Twix, but it's yeah. Reese's. Three to two in favor. Fifth of booster. Yeah. Sixth booster. I really, really, really. <laughs> You saying Twix twin <laughs> is killing me because I want to say I'm gonna say Twix. Oh, Marty! Oh, hell yeah! 
Yeah. Fuck. And he triplets. Because I like <laughs> Twix is, a It's lot. the Twixie triplets. And the way I, like, that cup sometimes is too much for me. And I, you know, I'm not letting the mob uh, Reese's uh, come after me. Thank you. And uh, that wafer in there, you even said it yourself, Francis. Give me it back. Give that me it back. Give me it back. That fucking wafer is unbelievable. It's son. good, <laughs> but it's not the mag. Uh, uh, any uh, moron could put it in this look circular look cup. Look standing up. Yeah, we're standing up to Reese's. 80 million votes. 80 million votes. Okay. Got you that candy. <laughs> okay, hey, Gooch, you want a tie break between Reese's and Twix? Reese's. Yeah! Reese's. yeah. Way to go, Gooch! Uh, Fuck! Uh, 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 Side fellas. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so Reese's versus Kit Kat to go into the finals against Almond Joy. <laughs> this is such a weird champion. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, do I like Kit Kat more than I hate Almond Exactly. <laughs> that will be the question. Um, uh, I'm Kit Kat. Uh, Kit Kat's so fucking good. I think these are both very good picks to be in the final. They're both just stick to their guns, exactly what they are. Kit Kat. Did ever make a peanut Kit Kat? I would eat. I would they didn't have to. Yeah, well, I don't, yeah, I guess I don't not, but I would like to I've never it. had any other Kit Kat. I really haven't. I always get the original. Uh, Francis? I'm gonna go get one after this. I can resist candy. I cannot resist Reese's. Mm. If there's a Reese's, I have to eat it, no matter if I'm like trying to watch my weight or whatever. So uh, Reese's, yeah. Reese's, Clemmer. The only bad thing about Reese's peanut butter cup when people like Francis call them Reese's. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> burn another yeah. clever burn holy shit Reese racking them up peanut butter cup one nothing ellis <laughs> no uh so what are you, you're going with <laughs> one one <laughs> <laughs> what is this game <laughs> uh tommy what are the rules uh, i'm going with kit kat look again i'm not the guy sitting here being like reese's is bad it's very good it's just not the king of all candy like we anoint it to be. I like Kit Kats more. Yeah, Kit Kats, two to two right now. <laughs> Nick, don't even have to ask. What my twins say? He said <laughs> Kit Kats. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm going Kit Kat. Kit three to two, KB. We're fun to say too. Yeah, these these two are always in the finals together. Yeah, I, I'm not. It's, there's no <laughs> no matter the sport. Here. It's, it, I'm gonna go Reese's by a little bit. Mm, so we're gonna be tied up, Gooch. You want to break again? Reese's versus Kit Kat. It's Reese's. You quit asking. Yeah. It's going to be Reese's every time. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this is fucking. I, I would have been uh, right. mad if Kit Kat weren't. Because I think yeah, Twix I are better than Kit Kat. is the winner of the bracket. And this next or round is going to destroy me. Okay. So, uh, I'm, I'm trying I'm, to no think one how... can even so pretend to say that Almond Joys are worse than <laughs> Reese's are good. So this is the. <laughs> I'm That's exactly what it is. So this is what you have to do. This is how we're voting on this. Are Almond Joys as bad as Reese's are good? Can we think of a hypothetical that's like you can. Would you rather never be able to. Would you rather never be able to eat a Reese's again or only get to eat Almond Joy again? Right. No, I like don't that. think that that is yeah, an equivalence. That might... I, I don't. I think the original thing I'd say, like, which one of these, like, is... I'd rather never like, get to eat Would you rather Reese's have neither again. or every time you wanted a Kit Kat, you had to eat an Almond Joy? I guess also frame it in the, in the fra way of Halloween, if that makes sense. So maybe if, like... Yeah. In, All right, well, no, here's a good way of, like, when, on Halloween, are you more excited when you see a Reese's or are you more disappointed when you see the Almond Joy? I guess, yeah, I think that, I think that works, right? Yeah. Let's do it. Let's. That's let's exactly like that. what we have been saying. Well, it was very the same. It's the same. Thing. You just. A you just sort of gave it a garnish. Best or worst. Best, best, worst, worst. Yeah. So start. I really concisely KB. got to the bottom of it. No, you elongated. Now concisely. You got flourished. To the of that. <laughs> KB. These two are way more alike than they are different. They're both good candy bars. Candy, good candy. Reese's. Reese's. Nick. If there's no Reese's in my sack, if there's no Reese's in my j plastic jack-o'-lantern, I'll grab a Twix. I'll grab a Snickers. Almond Joy is always sitting at the bottom of the bowl. It'll be in my mom. My mom had a little wicker basket where we, that I poured my candy into. It would be there till next Halloween. I the poured it from that. bottom of this wicker basket was paved in Almond Joy. <laughs> uh, fuck Almond Joy. Going with it. One to one. Tommy? Um, re fucking tweet everything he just said <laughs> times two. These two are oh. fucking just put your dicks in each other's asses. Two. Already. It's like, yeah, like if I got a bunch of almond joys, it'd be oh, if I got a bunch of Reese's, oh, nice, but like I want some other candies. It's mm -hmm. almond joy is worse than Reese's is good. Final answer, Clemmer. I don't know if you guys missed it, but I very generously gave everyone a Reese's peanut butter cup earlier on in this show. And when I did that, I did not get myself one because I have to be in a certain mood to enjoy candy. I'm not in that mood right now. Whoa. 
Oh, I am always crap. I am always in the mood. What a twist! I am always in the mood to ignore an almond joy. Wow. Almond joy is much wow. worse than. Oh, oh, almond joy. Animal. You're always in the what mood to ignore. <laughs> You're damn right. Yeah. Very well said, Clever. Clever put Very. his arm back like this. I just nailed that time one. You ignored an almond joy. <laughs> Wait, give us. <laughs> hey. Every second. No, so <laughs> you could get, you could go to the store any day, any day and just go get him. He chooses not to. Paradox. I kind of agree. When you're in the you candy aisle, right into his trap. Thank you, Chris. I would take these pieces. <laughs> when you're in the <laughs> when you're in the candy aisle and you see almond joy, you you are like, ugh. and you don't even have to no, get a Reese's. Right. You're just like, ugh. I always hate them. I always yeah. have time for hate. Reese's is like, oh, all right, it's there. We're three to one in favor of almond joy. This is awesome. <laughs> Boy, fucking crazy. The. The arguments have been stronger than I would have thought. I have to give you guys credit on that. I, I almost think this is like a an optimist versus pessimist type argument. Mm -hmm. um, I, I and maybe that just makes me a hopeful person. Maybe that just means I I see the world uh, from a better lens. I believe in people. <laughs> <laughs> I believe in you know good goodwill and uh, karma, and that I, I I try to believe in in my fellow man. Which is why I think that I enjoy a Reese's more than I hate anything. I, I, I you know, certainly more than you hate racism. Yeah, I don't, <laughs> I don't mind racism, <laughs> especially when I'm eating a Reese's. <laughs> that's the new slogan. Yeah, that's that's her new ad campaign. Oh man, yeah. So I'm gonna go with Reese's, and uh, I'm sure I've, I've given the sense it's not gonna win, but that's okay. Marty, when's the last time you had a and I'll enjoy KB. Probably four, five, maybe even six, seven, eight years. <laughs> <laughs> there's a lot of there's a lot of things that I consider fine that I don't indulge in. I'm going I'm enjoy. I just think that when you think of dessert, you just shouldn't have coconut there. And like huh. peanut I, butter I, yeah, makes I don't sense. With that part, but but I'm in what? I don't agree with I, my. Think I coconut think coconut should be in a dessert. Yeah, I like coconut. I think custard pie insane. a lot. I like coconut. Right. coconut Would you rather chocolate mousse or a, a, a coconut? Coconut custard, custard pie. pie. Chocolate mousse <laughs> too rich. Way too rich. But I just like almond joys for the almonds. You just like it for the coconut. That's fine. We still both dislike it. Uh, Marty, I'll give you one last chance. Are you sure you want to vote this way? Oh, what is Yes, Kendak? he does. Yeah, do. I, such a ooh, way, just wait. On. That is impartial. Uh, Are you sure? I'm I'm, uh, I'm then the winner is of this episode, Clemmer. Yeah. That's fine. I'm for the integrity. Oh my God. For the integrity. Uh, he played us all like a fiddle. <laughs> I was just, Genius. I'll bring in the Reese's, and they'll realize my pick was Reese's. Yeah, played like an absolute fiddle by Chris Clemmer, the winner of the bracket episode 99, best slash worst Halloween candy is Almond Joy. I'm de I'm despondent. But the I, like I, the thing, this whole winner thing, the only winner that we should be thinking about for every episode is the audience. We want the audience to have a great fucking time listening. <laughs> I think the audience is the real winner today. Yeah. Uh, Clever, why don't you donate that one to the audience? Give that one yeah, out to the audience. That That's true. You should donate. Give that one to the and audience. The audience gets to pick the next topic. Yeah. You guys make... Nope. I'm keeping it. Wow. I won. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so that's the winner. Uh, we'll be back for episode 100. Going to think of something special Whoa. for that one. Oh, great. That's uh, fucking really? Clemmer's response. Episode, yeah. <laughs> oh, no. I, I think I'll do 101. <laughs> Clemmer's going to be a guest on episode 101. Uh, we're going to see. We might have some special guests on episode 101. Oh, we'll what are you going to do? Best 1940s commercial actors, yeah. Clemmer? <laughs> Don't sleep on Philip Dick. Uh, I, I think you made that up. Rather before. not. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. Bill Dick. <laughs> uh, we'll be back next week with a new topic. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>